Welcome to the Fantasy Audiobook. One Piece. I have infinite devil fruit ability. Chapter 1. Holy Land, Mary Joa. The Red Earth Continent is located between the first half of the Great Voyage and the New World, as if it were a line, dividing the whole world in half. And the Holy Land of the World, Mary Joy, is located on the Red Earth Continent, as if a king is looking down on the whole world at all times, making people feel unreachable. Mary Joy can be said to be the most prosperous place in the world, but also the most beautiful place. Because in terms of geographical location alone, it is those beautiful places on the sea below, unreachable places, and Mary Hoya is surrounded by clouds and mist, if you look at it from a distance, it seems that Mary Hoya is placed on the clouds, like a heavenly palace in the sky. There are three bases on the periphery of Mary Joy, surrounded by a triangle. It is guarded by three powerful forces the headquarters of the world's navy, the world's largest prison city, and the world's largest military court. Because the world's nobles Tianlong people and nobles from all over the world, the high-level organs of the world government, all stand here. At the same time, it is the location of the world's highest power, five old stars and the headquarters of the world government. When you see my direct lineage, you don't even kowtow, do you still have any respect and inferiority? Somewhere in the Draco aristocratic realm of Mary Hoya, a blonde boy in a white garment full of decorations yelled at a black-haired boy about ten years old dressed in black. With that, the teenager kicked out and kicked the black-haired boy in the chest, kicking the boy back to the ground with a heavy kick. The black-haired boy fell to the ground and didn't get up again, but looked angrily at the arrogant and domineering blonde boy in front of him, and the two men in black clothes and indifference behind him, his little hands were bruised and clenched into fists, biting his lip with anger. But soon the little hand fist was released. The brunette boy knew he couldn't do it himself, and if he fought back, he would be in for trouble. HMPH, what? Do you want to hit me? The blonde boy smiled contemptuously when he saw the boy's hateful eyes, and roared at the boy. As soon as the words fell, the boy kicked out, kicking the black-haired boy directly five meters away, blowing up a pile of dust and covering his body. The whole person is not embarrassed, not angry, and not aggrieved. You are a sinister seed born of a cheap girl, and you dare to stare at me, a noble and incomparably pure heavenly dragon with that kind of eyes, do you know that you are looking for death again? The boy roared viciously, and spit spat out. There was anger and disdain in his eyes. The bloodline of the celestial dragons has been tarnished by you fool. I shouldn't have left you in the first place, I don't know what the Robert family thought, they would leave you with this half lowly bloodline and half noble bloodline. Quote. The boy snorted. The black-haired boy lay on the ground, his little face buried, unwilling to be angry, wronged and hateful hanging on it. Blood was pouring from the corners of his mouth, and he bit his lip. The black-haired boy's name is An Fan, and he also has another name, Zhang Fan, who is an ordinary young man about twenty years old from a blue earth in Washa. An accident inexplicably brought him to this One Piece world. Turned around and became a descendant of one of the twenty kings created by the world government, with the most noble Draco blood in the world, and the most noble baby in the world. He was greeted with endless glory, wealth and eminence, but he didn't expect to be greeted with endless humiliation and contempt. Because his mother was a slave, he lost everything of the nobility, and was reduced from a direct line to a side line, and he was not even allowed to have the surname Robert, leaving only his mother to obtain a name. And Fan, hence the name, it should be safe and ordinary. His father was an important member of one of the twenty royal families, and he was born after a chance drunken encounter with the boy's mother. His mother died not long after he was born, and the cause of death is unknown, but An Fan knew. They killed his mother. Although An Fan has a very weak affection for this One Piece world mother, a few months of breastfeeding care has given him, an orphan who has never felt mother's love in his previous life, everything. Now that he is dead, how can An Fan not hate? Knowing the truth that the power of the world is the king of One Piece, An Fan has been exercising his body since he was a child when he was able to walk, and sometimes secretly watching the training of the guards of the Draconian. In Merry Joy, he found that there were strong men everywhere, and they were heavily guarded. In addition to the strong people in the government, the rest are basically the strong people of the nobility, especially the strong people of the Tianlong people, who are even more terrifying. It's not like the waste materials of the original book at all. More than 30% of the people at the top of the world government are Draco nobles. 
even the highest decision maker of the world government, the five old stars, is also a celestial dragon noble. And Fan didn't understand how the Fiji fishman had rioted everywhere here and freed the slaves. In ten years, and Fan's physical fitness can be said to be stronger than that of people of the same age as the nobles of the Tianlong people, and it can be said that he deserves to be the first person among the ten-year-old Tianlong people. However, there is a clear distinction between the noble and the low among the Tianlong people, and the current age is young. It is still too early to say that it is the first person. After all. The children of the direct Tianlong people have devil fruits and other things at a certain age, and they cannot be at the same level at all. So An Fan did not expose his strong strength and slowly chose to hide. Ten years is very uncomfortable because of the sensitive identity. His collateral identity is simply useless, comparable to a slave. Because Mary Hoya has so many world nobles, especially this is the base camp of the Draco people. According to the rules of the world, everyone who encounters the Draco must kneel. Therefore, the five old stars issued an order, and when they met the Tianlong people, they could not kneel, but only salute or bow. And at Mary Joa's knees, there were only slaves. Now the young Tianlong man in front of him, Domingo, wants him to kneel when he sees him, treating him as a slave. How can An Fan agree? Kneel to the sky and kneel on the ground. The man has gold under his knees. Even if you die, you can't bow your legs. H M P H. Domingo snorted as he gestured to the two guards beside him. Give him ten lashes. Quote, yes. A ruthless guard next to him stepped forward, picked up the whip from his waist, and slammed it on Enfan's body. Bang, bang. Enfan was angry and hateful, and the heartache rushed through his body, and the ruthless guard whipped every whip very hard, and he gritted his teeth and couldn't hold back a trace of sound. H M P H. Quote, Domingo sneered a few times, waved his hand and strode away. Laughing at the same time, pump this evil seed for me. Quote, bang, bang, bang. After the whip was finished, the ruthless guards left, and An Fan gasped, covered in blood. I really deserve it. Quote, H M P H. This impure bloodline is simply tarnishing the noble bloodline of the Tianlong people. Quote, Why isn't this man dead? Quote, Looking at the indifferent and indifferent aristocrats around him who were watching and even insulting, and Fan clenched his fists, and madness and violence flashed in his eyes. And Fan roared wildly. One day in the future, he swore that he would absolutely kill the entire Draco nobles, even the so-called father who had never been in front of him. Kill, kill, kill. His hatred was enough to fill the entire sea. And Fan was covered in blood and struggled to return to his small home in the most remote place in the area where the Tianlong people live. This is a very simple house, of course, simple compared to the luxury villa. In fact, this house is not bad. There is a floor of the house covered with tiles and so on. In ten days, there will be a big competition every five years, and those with potential will be sent to the military academy for training and so on. And if we get into the top three hundred, I will be able to leave this hellish place. Quote. And Fan sat on his stool and gasped and said, "In this place, he was humiliated and did not drive him away. He had to wait for the nobles to hold a five-year competition. There will be a five-year competition in the Holy Land of Mary Joy, and there will be noble children and elite soldiers from all over the world to compete. And the top three hundred will be selected to enter a special military academy for key training. As long as the future is not damaged, Bai will be the elite of the world government and the pure power in his hands." And every session of the five old stars will watch it in person. And at the same time, there are a large number of high-level government and naval leaders, so there is no room for fraud. The tournament in this holy place, Mari Joy, requires people aged 10 to 15 to participate, and it is not possible to go over or under. Everyone hates fairness, and there are two competitions. But for Anfin, he only had one time. His participation in the competition will definitely be opposed by some people. But he has already submitted the registration, and those people can't help it. As long as he enters the top 300 and enters a special military academy to focus on training, then there is no then. If he fails and can't enter, and Fan can imagine his miserable end. So, and Fan can't lose. He must be in the top 300. He could have been ready to participate when he was 15 years old, but he couldn't wait. He couldn't wait to get out of here. He's been through it for so many years. However. It is still a little difficult to enter the top 300. The children of the elite nobles from all over the world, 
the elite soldiers from the major institutions of the world government, especially the elite soldiers from the Navy and the elite students of the Naval Military Academy. But even if there is a tiger, a wolf or an insect in front of him, he will defeat them all. Either it will turn into a dragon when it encounters a storm, or it will die without a whole corpse. He didn't have much choice, just now he went out to sign up. I should be able to recover from the injuries on my body in two or three days. I must train myself more in the remaining seven days. And Fan's face was full of resoluteness, clenching his fists, and he looked at the ten hideous whip scars of the small body in the mirror. Maybe it's because this world has power, so as long as your physical fitness is good enough and it's not a fatal injury, no matter how big the injury is, it can heal itself. Bang. Quote. Suddenly, the void behind and fan stirred, and there was a ripple like water ripples, and a void thing flew out and hit and fan on the back of the head. Oops. Quote. And fan snorted directly at this sudden blow, thinking that someone had come to teach him a lesson again, so he immediately touched the back of his head and turned around angrily, but he didn't see anything and the door was still closed. Ha! Huh. And Fan frowned and looked around suspiciously. Bang! Quote. And Fan wanted to see if there was anyone, moved his steps forward, and suddenly felt like he was kicking something down, and his eyes looked down, and his eyes immediately condensed. The look of disbelief swept over the eyes. A void-colored fruit covered with a, arabesque-like, spiral pattern lies quietly. And Fan was not mistaken. It's a devil fruit. Devil fruits. Where did it come from? How did you quietly appear at his house? Lying at his feet. What kind of devil fruit is this? And Fan picked it up and looked at it quietly. This devil fruit cantaloupe was shaped like a pineapple rune protruding, looking like a spiral pattern emitting magical power, is this a superpower? Wait, why does this devil fruit look so familiar? Question mark. And Fan frowned slightly. He felt that this devil fruit seemed to have been seen in the devil fruit illustrated book, although the devil fruit illustrated book was very precious, but it was just like garbage here, he had the honor of picking up a few devil fruit illustrated books to watch. The devil fruit in it makes and fan salivate, known as the secret treasure of the sea, it is the incarnation of the demon of the sea, and after eating it, it will get different abilities, but as a price, those who eat it will be disgusted by the sea and become landlubbers, despite this, and Fan still dreams of getting a devil fruit and is sought after. Without him, the devil fruit can multiply its own combat power several times. Of course, if you encounter garbage fruits, you can only consider yourself unlucky. Look at what kind of fruit this is, it will appear in my house, this ability should be strong. And Fan said, quickly came to the drawer, opened it and took out three devil fruit illustrated books, and began to turn the pages to find it, constantly comparing them. After a few minutes of quick searching, Zhang Fan finally found it on the last one. Infinite devil fruits, superhuman system, at the same time, it belongs to the natural system, it's very mysterious. After eating, you can infinitely swallow and fuse the power of all devil fruits. Born and mature, it drops and disappears autonomously. If no one eats it, then it will automatically disappear every 10 years, appear somewhere in the world. And Fan was stunned, I'm not dreaming anymore. This devil fruit, looks like a bit of a cow ex. Manipulating the space, it will automatically disappear every 10 years and appear somewhere in the world, how much luck can it be to be hit by gold falling from the sky? This is simply like going to the earth in the previous life, a dick was suddenly told by a rich man to give you 100 million for free, and by the way, he sent by Fumei's daughter over. No, I'm going to have a heart attack and die. And Fan clutched his chest, his heart was beating very violently, and he was very excited. Ten years have been difficult, and now he can finally rise, and Fan thought excitedly, with this devil fruit, he has hope for ten years of humiliation. It's not the kind of empty slogan that I used to shout, but I actually know that I don't have the ability to kill all the nobles of the Tianlong people. But now, from slim to bright, I'm going to kill you. Thinking of ten years of humiliation, and Fan saw the hatred in his eyes like fire, burning fiercely, and immediately bit on the void devil fruit. And Fan's face suddenly stiffened, and his eyes were blank. It's so bitter and unpalatable. I'm the legendary taste of poop. The voice of miserable pain came from the darkness of the house. Fusion Devouring Replication 3 Abilities And Fan stood at the door, looking at the sun shining in the sky, and thought quietly. In the blink of an eye, ten days have passed, the injuries on his body in three days have been much better, 
and the remaining seven days have healed directly, in these ten days, and Fan has either trained himself or used his infinite fruit ability. Through a few days, and Fan determined that the infinite fruit had three main abilities, the ability to fuse, devour, and replicate the three bunker heavens. Fusion allows him to eat unlimited devil fruits, and the ability to eat them can be perfectly integrated with himself. Devouring allows him to absorb everything while sucking perfectly into himself. Copying allows him to copy an infinite number of things, and as long as the copied thing is not destroyed, the copy will not disappear, and the copy will be the same as the copied one. Infinity as the name suggests has no boundaries, there are no restrictions, anything can be fused into itself, devoured into itself, and copied into itself. Among the three fruit abilities, and Fan only tried to devour, devouring an ant, an ordinary ant, and he could trample it to death with one foot. Of course, this ant is not the ants of the earth, after all, they grew up in the One Piece world, and they are aggressive. We all know that an ant can lift something more than 400 times its own weight, its strength is very strong and violent, and the ants in the One Piece world can lift more than 1000 times their own weight, which is as fierce as a tiger wolf. But despite this, for the people of the One Piece world, it can't be weaker anymore. Moreover, although ants are aggressive, they generally do not take the initiative to attack people, and their nature is the same as that on Earth. And Fan devoured such an ant, and directly absorbed the giant power gene in the ant, and its power was terrifying, and it directly exploded by 100 times. It used to be able to break stones, but now it can break steel. Having tasted the sweetness, and Fan devoured an ant again, this time without adding anything, and it seemed that some could only be devoured once. The strength has increased by 100 times, and this time it is certain that I will be in the top 300. And Fan thought secretly in his heart. As soon as he arrived, he saw dozens of teenagers gathered there, all of them with arrogant and domineering faces, and there was no one in their eyes. To make Uncle Ben wait for so long, to find an opportunity to sue the lieutenant general to the world government, and revoke his lieutenant general, we are waiting here. It's disgusting. Quote, a young man of the celestial dragon nobles clenched his fists and shouted, his words ushered in the approval of many of the same nobles around him. Da, and Fan didn't pay attention to it, just casually found one to see the wall and leaned over, closing his eyes quietly. Ha, huh, a noble boy noticed and Fan and immediately shouted, isn't this the evil seed? As soon as these words came out, everyone's eyes looked at them. He has short black hair, wears a simple black power suit, and dresses like a beggar. In the eyes of the nobles of the Draconians. Everyone looked at Anfan with a look of disgust, disgust, disdain, and contempt on their faces. Who told you to come here? Do you want to die? Several celestial dragon nobles scolded. You evil seed, you really don't know whether you live or die, and you dare to sign up for the Holy Land contest without permission. A blonde boy Draco nobleman rushed forward and scolded, this blonde boy was Domingo, who had always liked to bully Anfin. I should have known I should have given you a hundred lashes and beaten you half to death. Domingo scolded and stepped forward and slapped him in the face. Bang! And Fan grabbed Domingo Saint's left hand, his eyes widened, and a trace of scarlet light swept by. And Fan looked at Domingo's hateful and angry face with a gloomy face, and said in a cold voice, Holy young Master Domingo, you shouldn't forget the people who participated in the Holy Land competition, the contestants can't do anything with each other. How dare you defile this hand, I will kill you. Seeing and Fan grabbing his left hand, Domingo Saint immediately screamed. As for what and Fan said, he didn't listen to it at all. You killed him for me. Quote, Domingo Saint felt that his hand was firmly grasped as if it was being pincered, and he screamed and shouted, and immediately two black shadows appeared, as fast as lightning, and a strong wind blew, one left and one right towards and fan. Everyone looked at it indifferently, and even some of them revealed excitement and longing for and fan to die immediately. And fan looked at Domingo Saint with a quiet and gloomy face, ignoring the two guards who attacked. The strong wind blowing makes people's faces and skin hurt. Two iron fists, one left and one right, bombarded and fan's temples. Suddenly, a cold wind blew, and a chill rose through the heart. Click, click, two freezing sounds sounded, and the two guards who attacked and fan became two ice sculptures, maintaining the appearance of attacking. Ha, Domingo's pupils shrank, 
Ah, a tall man in a white suit vest and dark blue shirt dressed in a massive navy uniform appeared, looking at Domingo with a hood on his forehead and a chill in his eyes. Kuzan, pheasant. When and Fan saw this tall man, a name suddenly appeared in his heart, Admiral, eating the frozen fruit of the top fruit of the natural system. And Fan felt a look silently peeking at them just now, and he ignored the attack of the two guards, but he didn't expect it to be Kuzan, the pheasant general. However, looking at his naval costume, this pheasant does not seem to be an admiral yet. Lieutenant General Pheasant, what do you mean, are you obstructing me from cleaning up this evil seed? said Domingo Saint with a cold face, he is a Tianlong nobleman, the world's top noble, and even the generals have to obey their commands. You let him go, the pheasant said to Enfan. Enfan nodded, threw Domingo Saint out with a flick of his hand, and slammed it on the ground. The pheasant looked at it, and the corners of his eyes twitched slightly. You fool dare to do it to me. Domingo Saint got up, his eyes were about to explode, he looked at Enfan, and roared angrily. A descendant of one of his twenty royal families, a pure-blooded celestial dragon, Domingo Saint was unexpectedly thrown away by an evil seed that defiled the bloodline of the celestial dragons. Now he didn't expect an fan's amazing strength, and now he thought about the issue of face. He could feel the ridicule of the nobles behind him who were also celestial dragons, and he could imagine how much of a laughing stock he would become in the future, how could he endure it with such a proud personality. And you fool, seeing the great draconians being attacked, where is it silent, I will tell the world government to revoke your rank of lieutenant general. Domingo roared. The pheasant gave Domingo a cold look. Whatever. Quote. I'm your proctor, this time I'm going to lead you to an island, and that island has a big prison LV1 LV3 to release the most evildoers, and your first one is, them. The 10 million bounty is 1000 points, and so on. The top 10 will be the top 300, and the first place will be able to participate in the final top 30 competition. Quote. As soon as these words came out, everyone was shocked. What, in the past, the Holy Land contest was not like this. It was not a competition against each other, it took more than 10 games, but now why are there only two of them? And we have to kill those people to calculate the score. Doesn't that mean that our lives are not guaranteed? The game is so ridiculous. This is an order from the five elders of the star, and you can raise your opinions to the world government yourself. Quote. Everyone shut up. It's too late to quit now, once you enter the island, life or death. Quote. Following Qingzi, Anfin walked out of the aristocratic area for the first time, came to a huge dock, and boarded a huge naval ship to prepare for departure. At this time, the number of nobles who were willing to participate in the competition had been reduced by a third, and none of the flowers in their greenhouses were willing to give up their precious lives. Especially when I learned that there would be ten naval warships surrounding the island for monitoring, some people who wanted to think carefully were directly suppressed. So in the beginning, a lot of borers were removed. As for whether those who stay will be elites, it remains to be verified. There are so many people. Quote, and Fan looked at it, there were three naval warships that were full, most of them were world nobles, and the rest should be the elites cultivated by the world government. HMPH, that's a lot of garbage. A very discordant voice came from the side, and an fan glanced at it, it was a golden-haired Draco boy with hair standing up and curling up at the ends, it was the blonde boy who scolded him when he came before. The eyes were high and upward, and he didn't put anything in his eyes, and there was a discriminatory look in his eyes. I have to say that the Tianlong nobles are like this, maintaining a slave social system, having a strong sense of bloodline, and having a strong sense of racial superiority, of course, this is only the majority. And Fan was tasteless and walked aside. What do you mean? The blonde boy pointed at Enfan and scolded, and when he saw him coming, and Fan walked away, which was simply naked ignorance, as if he disdained to be in the company of garbage, and directly became angry. And Fan's face was expressionless, but there was a trace of killing intent in his eyes, and he had some scheming in his heart. At the meeting, all the islands will be free to kill the criminals released by the advanced city, and everyone is in danger of their lives, which means that it is normal for one or two people to die. Ha! Huh, a sneer flashed in Fan's heart. Ha! Huh, and Fan suddenly felt that someone was watching, and as soon as his eyes were raised, he saw Qingzi looking at him deeply, and his heart was shocked, but in order to cover up his weakness, he still looked directly at Qingzi's eyes without fear. Ha! Huh, 
Xingzi smiled lightly, and his gaze skimmed to another place. It's so powerful, and Fan felt that under the childish gaze, all the thoughts in his heart were looked at, this is the future general's strength scolding. But I'll be able to surpass him in the future. And Fan clenched his fists, he has infinite devil fruits, and he has infinite possibilities in the future. HMPH. On the other side, Domingo, whose face was gloomy, looked at Anfin's weak body, not knowing what he was thinking. Everybody's here, well, that's it, let's go. Qingzi waved his hand and said loudly. Half an hour later, bang, with a few drops of anchor, five warships docked on an island surrounded by ten large warships. The purpose has arrived, Lieutenant General, said an officer who came to Qingzi and saluted. Well, let's start the game. Quote, Qingzi said lightly. Ah, Lieutenant General, are you sure you don't need to say anything? Said the officer, surprised. It's all about it, and it's not intentional to say more. Let these guys go now. Yes, I'm so sleepy. The two or three hundred noble young elite teenagers who yawned and walked down with weapons shook their heads and pulled down the bags under their eyes, sat on a chair, and snored after a while. I saw the soldiers and officers around me sweating profusely. These nobles don't enjoy themselves at home, but they actually come to participate in the Holy Land competition, it seems that they are really idle for their own lives. Quote, All the soldiers held their weapons and watched the aristocratic young men who walked into the Black Forest shook their heads and thought, there are hundreds of LV1 LV3 extreme criminals in this island. I don't know how many people will come out in the end. However, no matter how many people come out, it will not be their business, and what the elders of the five elder stars of this competition demanded, when the time comes, those nobles will also make trouble with the world government. And even if they want to make trouble, do those guys have the guts? And Fan didn't take any weapons, and quickly entered the dark and secluded forest, escaped into it to hide himself, and everyone quickly entered the forest. Keep going deeper. Bang. Quote. A noble young man stepped on the branch of a large tree, cautious and vigilant, and nodded when he saw that the surroundings were quiet. No one. Quote. As soon as he finished speaking, a rope suddenly flew out, wrapped around his neck, and hung him tightly. Phew. Quote. The aristocratic young man stared wide-eyed, and his hands strangled the rope around his neck, and at this moment, a chill flashed. Poof. Quote. The sound of blood gushing out was like a fountain. The first. A middle-aged man with a knife and wearing a black and white prisoner's uniform said in a low and indifferent voice. Let's start the killing. Poof. Quote. Another sound of entering the flesh sounded, the middle-aged knife's pupils shrank, his head trembled down, and he wanted to turn back with a hand that passed through his chest in disbelief. Click. Quote. Domingo sneered at the headless corpse lying on the ground and was smashed by his palm, and looked at his left hand changing into a yellow tiger arm with bulging muscles, and said with an arrogant smile, Fortunately, my family gave me an animal-based tiger devil fruit, otherwise I wouldn't have done it to participate in such a dangerous competition. An afterimage flashed and struck Domingo. Ha! Domingo's pupils widened. Poof! Domingo stabbed a gorgeously dressed young man with his left hand, and under his incredulous gaze, he said in a cruel voice, You lowly bloodlines dare to eat black and want to take advantage of it. Then you will die for me. After saying that, Domingo's terrifying blow directly smashed the upper half of the young man's body to pieces, which was extremely terrifying. I've lived for more than 3,500 points, killing a 10 million bounty and a few hundred king-level criminals. And Fan, who was covered in blood, leaned against a big tree and said in his heart. Around his waist hung six or seven bloody heads wrapped in coarse cloth. This island is really full of criminals, if it weren't for its own strength enough, it is estimated that it will be ambushed and killed by those criminals who are waiting for the rabbit. And Fan was ambushed, but if his strength is strengthened, all of them will be killed. This game lasted for three hours, and now half an hour has passed, more than 3,500 points is not enough, and insurance needs at least 100 million points. And Fan thought indifferently. Ha ha ha, ha. Suddenly, an arrogant voice came, and an Fan's brows suddenly furrowed. The laughter is familiar. This is a familiar voice. And Fan frowned, his whole body tensed, he didn't know why he hated this laughter so much, and he had an urge to kill the owner of this laughter. After killing so many people at once, his blood and chi are vigorous. 
walking in the direction where the laughter came from, Anfin saw Domingo laughing wildly there, several corpses lying beside him, and several wrapped heads rolling on the lawn. This is... And Fan's eyes twitched, looking at Domingo in disbelief, this guy was actually black. Ha ha, I didn't think there was such a way, it's easy. It's really effortless. 1, 2, 3, 14, 27, quack, that's great, so many. It's ironclad to be in the top 10, and if I continue like this, it's absolutely possible to get the first fight. Domingo laughed, laughing uncontrollably, hoping to attract more attention. This fool ate a devil fruit. Anfin's eyes narrowed, looking at Domingo's two tiger arms. I have heard that when the celestial dragon nobles reach a certain age, they will give their children devil fruits, quickly gain power, and control the super institution of the world government, and it is easy to get devil fruits. It is no wonder that the strong people of the Tianlong people are like clouds, with a transcendent status, and control the world government, because once the next generation stands out and is cultivated, it is so strong that it is not a star and a half, and it is not the same. Who? Domingo's pupils widened, his laughter stopped, his eyes looked at this side fiercely, and he saw and fan at a glance, and suddenly his violent anger burst out. It's you, you see. Domingo's eyes turned scarlet, and the veins on his face exploded. You eat animal tiger fruit. I see. No wonder you've become like this. Quote. Anfin was familiar with the series of various devil fruits, and immediately recognized the kind of fruit that Domingo ate. Tiger tiger fruit, a superhuman ancient beast, has the ability to transform into a tiger, which is very precious, and has all the abilities of a tiger, especially in terms of strength and agility, which is even more terrifying. However, there are many shortcomings, the first few times I didn't have the ability to control the transformation, it was easy to go berserk and be swallowed by negative emotions, especially this Domingo who killed so many people. It is estimated that his mind has been swallowed up by negative emotions now, especially after seeing himself, I am afraid that it will be on fire. I am going to kill you, you fool, I hate you so much, you have made me lose so much face, and become a laughingstock in the aristocratic circles, I want you to wash away the shame with your blood. Domingo roared furiously. HMPH, do you think you have this ability? And Fan said with a gloomy face, his strength has been strengthened a hundred times, he is not afraid. And he also wants to kill Domingo, if he doesn't score from the ground, he will rush to the humiliation given to him for ten years, how uncomfortable will he be in the future if he doesn't kill him? HMPH, Domingo laughed violently a few times, and immediately rushed towards Anfan, the whole person turned into a tiger, transformed into a huge tiger, and shot at Anfan. Bang, quote, and Fan blocked it with both hands, and the power contained in Domingo's kick was extremely terrifying, making his hands hurt, and his blood was churning, which was a little uncomfortable. This power is even on par with mine, this devil fruit, sure enough, BT, can make people's strength skyrocket so many times. Quote. It was able to resist my leg, and the strength was not bad. Domingo smiled coldly, clenched his left hand, squeezed the sound of air, and slammed down with a punch. Poof, quote, a sound of cutting meat rang out, and Fan suddenly kicked out high, and with great force, he kicked out a blade of air, slashing through the air and slashing at Domingo's mouth. A surge of blood rushed up. Ah, Domingo screamed, this is not over, and Fan kicked out again, thousands of pounds of attack force kicked him out, and the impact force made him knock down a big tree. How do you know how to be Lanjiao? Domingo said with a scream, and the transformation retreated, blood pouring from the horrible wound on his mouth. The skin is all broken. Phew, quote, and Fan turned into an afterimage and came to the front, chuckled, looking at Domingo's miserable appearance, he felt so happy in his heart. You can't kill me, Domingo suddenly screamed when he saw and Fan's murderous intent in his eyes. Why can't I kill you? And Fan stepped on Domingo's noble face and said coldly. If you kill me, the world government won't let you go. Domingo shouted. HMPH. And Fan sneered, if I let you go, you will let me go. Domingo was stunned. You didn't expect to have today, did you? Ten years of humiliation in exchange for today's death, you have earned it. And Fan said in a cruel voice, stomping hard, stomping his face into a ball. Don't you just think it's noble? Pure. Today I will trample on you products of intermarriage. You used that kick so hard. No wonder it was so powerful. 
Quote, How do you know? How do I know? HMPH, you go down and ask Lord Yama. And Fan said hideously, and after speaking, a virtual ball swung out of his hand, and he threw it on Domingo's body, wrapped it in an instant, and then turned into powder. HMPH, that's how I know. Block of iron. And Fan smiled coldly, and the muscles in his body were as hard as steel. Navy 6, I know iron, shaving, Lanjiao 3, it seems that I have to devour more nobles, these nobles are too stupid, few of them have mastered the Navy 6. And Fan said with a cold face, looking at the ground rolling a few points. There are 100 million points. Quote, but it's still not enough, I think it will take at least 300 million to be insured, because I want to take the first place. It's like this, let's kill it, kill. In the center of the forest, nearly 100 criminal figures carrying murderous knives and wearing prison uniforms gathered here. Everyone has a very heavy murderous aura, and it is obvious that there are no longer a few people who have been killed. What does the world government mean, release us as prey? Said a man with a scar on his face angrily. Those guys in the world government are hypocrites, in the name of justice, how can they actually be better? Said a man with a belly on his chest angry. They think that the pampered nobles can take us as prey, said the other in a cold voice. HMPH, don't look at who's the prey, who's the hunter. But we've already killed a lot of people. What are you afraid of? With Big Brother Zell leading, we are the hunters, and they are the prey. One shouted. Everyone looked at a man with a fat upper body and a short and ugly lower body, and everyone showed admiration on their faces. HMPH, the ugly man took a bite of the cooked meat and sneered. Marfa Zell, ugly bandit, former leader of the handsome pirates, with a bounty of 87 million bailey, advancing to LV3. Ha, here, at this time, several discordant voices came, and everyone's eyes looked over, and they immediately saw a few noble children with shocked expressions. We seem to be in the wrong place. A noble boy swallowed and said. We're in the wrong place. The other nodded, and his haughty legs were a little weak under so many tiger-like stares. We're passing by, ha ha. A noble young man from the celestial dragon laughed and immediately wanted to turn away. Ha ha. A rude laugh rang out, and Zell laughed out loud with the flesh in his hand, very hideous. You are actually passing by, so stay here with us. Zell said with hideous pupils. I'm a Draco nobleman, you can't do this to me. Quote. HMPH, except for the Draconians, all the others were killed. Quote. Yes. Ah. The terrible sound startled a large number of birds. Ha, huh, and Fan, who was walking in the woods with a moon step, frowned, and immediately made a sharp break turn, stepping in the direction of the source of the sound. Bang, bang, bang. Quote dot. The sound of stepping in the air, and Fan stepped all the way away, and a large area of bright light appeared in his eyes. Little ones, if we capture this Draco nobleman, we can blackmail the world government to let us go, and then we will be free and dominate the ocean again. Our handsome pirates are about to gallop on this sea again, and wealth and beauties are waiting for us. Drink, Brother Zell is mighty, Captain is mighty. Quote. Drink, Brother Zell is mighty, Captain is mighty. Quote. Hearing the voice, and Fan quickly hid in a big tree, his eyes glancing lightly. Seeing an ugly-looking man who wanted to vomit, he pointed to a frightened Tianlong noble young man next to him and shouted loudly, and there were nearly a hundred people below who were very emotional and shouted. Ha! Huh, the corners of an fan's eyes moved slightly, so many people are a bit tricky. But after slaughtering so many groups of guys before, what are these minions? Who is it? Hearing the sound, several pirates turned to the side, and when they saw a child dressed in black standing not far from them with an indifferent expression, they immediately smiled contemptuously, it's a little ghost. Quote. As soon as he finished speaking, several pirates were stunned, why were they retreating, and whose lower body was it? Kill. Violence flashed in an fan's eyes, and his toes touched the ground and he flicked it, and a vacuum slash came out, and the huge cyan chi blade directly slashed the ten people in front of him, and they all died unintelligible. Quote question mark question mark question mark quote. The sudden attack stunned everyone, and so did Zell. Taking advantage of the fact that these guys were stunned, and Fan quickly jumped in the air, and with another spinning land foot, he slashed out several vacuum slashes, and in an instant, many people were directly cut in half by the air blade, and they were chopped to death. A few seconds of continuous rotation of crazy land feet, 
and a bloody severed limb below, extremely terrifying and terrifying. Phew, quote, and Fan fell to the ground, gasped heavily, and looked at the ugly fat man on the rock with his vicious eyes. At this time, Zell had cold sweat on his forehead, and his eyes were wide and trembling as he looked at Anfin. This kid turned out too. This is definitely a bear child. Murderous bear child. Terrifying bear child. It's you. The young nobleman of the celestial dragon recognized and fan clearly, and he was a little hard to believe that the person who had been bullied by them had such a powerful and terrifying strength. Unbelievable, unbelievable. He was blind. Ha, huh. Zell was overjoyed when he saw that this Draco boy knew this terrifying bear child, and grabbed the Draco boy with his rough hand and threatened and fan. Tell you, you'd better not take a step forward, or I'll kill him. Quote. The celestial dragon man and Anfan were stunned. The corners of Anfan's mouth suddenly hooked, and he covered his stomach and laughed. Zell looked nervous, and the knife was placed on the neck of the young man of the draconian, and a bloody mark was imprinted, and he shouted, If you dare to come, I will kill him. The young man of the Tianlong people was shocked, and hurriedly said to Anfan, Evil seed, don't come here, evil. Ha! Huh. The face of the Tianlong man was like earth, and he didn't know what Anfan's name was. HMPH. Anfan smiled evilly at the corner of his mouth, moved his hand slightly, and murmured softly. Zell immediately felt as if the knife in his hand was being pushed by an inexplicable force. Telekinesis. Quote. Poof. Quote. There was a sound of cutting throats into flesh, and scarlet blood gushed out. Zell felt the warm liquid in his hand and was dumbfounded. Shaving. Quote. And Fan appeared in front of Zell and said indifferently, There are so many strange things in the world. An hour later. Run, everyone, break it, this demon is catching up. Quote. What is he going to do? Is he going to kill us all? Isn't he afraid of punishment from the army outside? Don't say so much, just run, don't let him catch up, it's over. Quote. When we go out, we must punish this evil seed well, and they actually attack us. Several aristocratic young men of the celestial dragon people, dressed in gorgeous clothes and covered in blood, fled, looking very panicked and embarrassed, and they were extremely scared. Shaving. Quote. A low snort. Arashi. Quote. Then another vacuum slash kicked out, and five huge heads with despair and horror flew up with blood. And Fan's afterimage appeared in front of the five corpses, and said with an indifferent expression. Did I allow you to escape? HMPH. You've humiliated me like slaves for ten years, and today I'm going to slaughter you like pigs. And Fan said with a sneer. How many are these? This generation has come out to participate in the competition, and more than fifty Tianlong people, noble teenagers, have already been killed. And Fan shook his wrist and thought in his heart, more than fifty heavenly dragon nobles, a hundred other world nobles, and some government elites, all nearly two hundred participants died at his hands. Among them, the government elite devoured all of them, devouring their memories and physical energy, and the strength explosion also learned a number of attack techniques, especially the Navy 6, which he had already learned. Once devoured, those things seemed to be born to use them, which is really amazing. In addition, and Fan also has the ability to devour more than a dozen devil fruits, but most of them are very rubbish in his opinion, and only two are useful. Restore the fruit, the physical injuries can be quickly recovered, and the stronger the physical fitness, the faster the recovery. The mental power fruit has the ability to manipulate and attach attacks, and the stronger the mental power, the more powerful the control power will be. What are the rest of the tiger fruits, what are the rabbit fruits? Don't do it all, don't devour. In the end, only two remained. This time the people on the island must be killed, not a single one will be missing, there is still half an hour before the end of the game, I have to hurry. And Fan looked into the depths of the forest and said in a cold voice. This generation of aristocratic elites was all bloodily disposed of by him, and you can imagine how terrible the impact will be at that time. But he doesn't regret it, ten years of humiliating revenge, just for today's massacre. It won't work to miss any of them, because there will definitely be some suspicions about the living in an investigation, especially for him who has no background and has been bullied. But on the other hand, if he was the only one alive, it wouldn't be much of a problem, because they wouldn't believe that a ten-year-old kid could kill all the people on the island. Even if it still raises suspicion in the future, it doesn't matter. 
he was the only one alive in the first game of the noble children, and the sensation caused by it could definitely make him famous in the world and enter the sight of various bigwigs. Of course, once it leaks, he will die with no place to bury. Holy Land, Mary Joa, the central hall of the world government, a luxurious hall carved by white jade, does not have too many decorations, only simple sofas and office seats, although simple but revealing a kind of atmosphere, there are five old men in it, standing or sitting or leaning, majestic as the sea there is an unfathomable strength. Because most of it is omitted, and it is changed to a fighting competition where life is at stake, I don't know how many of those guys will make a fuss. The old man in a black suit, with long straight white hair and a long beard, said with a chuckle with his hands in his pants. Well, I'm afraid a lot of people will die this time, especially the nobles, game, we let them fight those guys who pushed into the city prison in the first level, hee <laughs> hee. Dressed in a black suit, bald head, with a figure eight beard. The old man with a birthmark on his forehead said. The main purpose of this holy land contest is to select the absolute elite and the strongest one who wins will be appointed as the director of the intelligence agency of the world government, so a lot of things are omitted, there must be an absolute elite, as for how many people will die in the first game of the nobles, I don't care, I just want the result, select the absolute strong, I don't want them to lose to civilian-born people from the navy and other institutions, the intelligence agency of the world government is only served by the people of our nobles. As for those people who want to make trouble, do they dare? Their nobility is what we gave them. The old man in a black suit, with white curly hair, a flat hat, and a scar on the left side of his face, sat on a thick jade ladder and said in a deep voice with a thick spiral cane. Hey, these guys too. Often provoke right and wrong outside. And lose the reputation of our world government, the Holy Land Dobby thinks that it is still the same as before, competing with each other, after countless competitions, and finally winning the championship and waiting for the world government to train them or something, although the cultivation is strong, but I haven't seen much blood, it's just a paper tiger, and it's useless, so this time I directly stand out with killing, hoping to produce a few useful iron-blooded boys. Quote. The old man in a white robe, bald head, glasses, and a long knife in his hand said. How many celestial dragons are there in the first game of the nobles this time, and the nobles of the world participate? Originally, 135 Tianlong people signed up, but the actual number of participants was 76, 356 people originally signed up for the world nobles, but 167 people actually signed up, and 45 people originally signed up for the elite members of the world government, but there were 45 people. Quote. HMPH. These nobles are really not as good as the generation, this is the lowest in history, and those who did not participate in the competition are forbidden to participate in it in the future. This generation of aristocrats relied on these people who participated in the competition. Dressed in a black suit, but without a tie, blonde hair. The old man with a scar in front of him said dissatisfiedly. Dada, quote, there was a rush of running. Your Excellency the Fifth Elder Star, there is an urgent report. Quote. Come in. Quote. A man in a black suit walked in, bowed, and then said profusely, Your Excellency the Fifth Elder Star Elder, just now. Just now, Lieutenant General Qingzi came with the news, saying. Say. The man in the black suit gasped and was very nervous. Say it quickly. The five old stars frowned and said coldly. Lieutenant General Qingzi sent news that in the first game of the nobles, all the nobles who participated in the competition were killed, and only one survived. Quote. What? The five old stars were taken aback and stood up one after another, their eyes in disbelief. All the criminals who were released from the city and sentenced to death also died. Quote. All things considered, only one person survived. Quote. The face of the five old stars, whose face had been unchanged and had not changed, was very shocked and ugly. Contact me immediately, and I will call him personally to find out what happened. The five old stars with flat hats and curly hair said with a solemn expression. The aristocrats of the contestants are all dead. All of them are dead. The world is shocked. In addition, the news is blocked, and the world nobles of the Holy Land cannot know a single piece of information, and once it is leaked, all of them will be executed. Quote. Yes, and Fan, who was covered in blood, put his hands down indifferently, and the soldiers saluted and stood in front of Qingzi and the other soldiers. Not far behind him was a pile of corpses, 
divided into two piles, one of which were pirates who had been hunted out of the city in prison uniforms, and the other was a group of nobles who were all dressed in gorgeous costumes but did not look at themselves. It was shocking that so many slain nobles were piled together. I'm not mistaken. The nobles are all dead, and he is the only one alive, so I didn't wake up today. A navy soldier said in a cold sweat. Clean the entire island, but I didn't expect there to be only one alive. The aristocracy must have shocked the whole world by dying so much this time. A government official in a black suit and a western hat also said in a cold sweat, he could think of the anger of those world nobles, and the whole world would blow a hurricane. The only boy alive, in particular, will also shock the whole world. All the participants died, but the boy did not, and that's why. Xingzi looked at Anfan with a dark face, and asked in a haze, do you know what happened? It would have been a thankless task to oversee the first game of the nobles this time, and now this kind of thing is happening. Xingzi didn't dare to think about it. How do I know? replied Anfan indifferently, would he be stupid enough to say that he had killed them all? Xingzi's face was ugly, and he wanted to say something, but a soldier rushed up. Lieutenant General, the fifth elder star elder has called. Quote, ha, Xingzi frowned and picked up the snail. Your Excellency the five star elder. Quote, tell me everything. Quote, yes, Xingzi was the first to hand over the bounty to Anfan, and then after the time, all the soldiers entered the island to clean up, but they didn't expect that there were corpses of nobles who died tragically everywhere. Tell the five old stars. Anfin, is he a world nobleman? Why doesn't he have a surname? How many points did he get? He is a nobleman of the celestial dragons, and he came back with a head with a bounty of 80 million and got 8,000 points. Quote, who, was a little surprised on the other end of the line. Ugly man, Marfa, Zell. Quote, there was silence on the other end of the line. Give the phone to that Anfin. Quote, and Fan took the phone indifferently and stood with a loud military salute. Five elder star elders. Quote, hum, the other end of the line seemed satisfied. Are you a Draco nobleman? What's your name? I am a descendant of the celestial dragon nobles, and my original name is Robert. Anfin. Quote, the Robert family. Yes, the other end of the phone pondered for a moment, and then said, you are the first place in this noble competition, I hope you can win the championship. Quote, go and gather information about an fan to me. After hanging up the snail phone, the five old stars shouted at the government official just now. Anfin, formerly known as Robert Anfin, Robert Tenryu family. His father Robert Ronnie Saint, the current patriarch of the former young master of the Robert family. His mother Nikki Tare, mother of the former Robert family maid, an accident had Anfin, this accident caused the Robert family's reputation to be greatly damaged, and directly forced Nikki Tay to die, and then demoted Anfin to the side, and rushed to an abandoned house, imprisoned in the aristocratic area, everyone had great discrimination, ten years of abuse and humiliation, every meal was the same as the amount of food for the dog. Quote. A government official in a black suit stood in front of the five old stars with a document and reported that if Anfan was here, he would find that on this document, there were all his information, all of which were a lot, and it was simply his life file. After listening to all the information of an fan, the five old stars looked at each other, and there was some surprise in their eyes. The white-robed five old stars waved their hands and motioned for the government personnel to go down, and after the door was closed, he said, if you say so, the death of everyone this time is inseparable from an fan, and it is very likely that he will slaughter everyone by himself. Quote, it's not very likely, it's 100% certain. The five old stars on crutches said, 10 years of humiliation, this kind of forbearance. How powerful the scheming is. I wonder where an fan's strength comes from, and he can kill everyone on the island in three hours with one fell swoop. Quote, didn't you hear that just now? This and fan often peeked at the training of some guards, and then worked his own. The blonde five old stars said, I naturally know this. I'm just curious, how his strength has been cultivated in the past 10 years, you must know that the people on the island are not a group of pigs, and even if it is a pig, he has to slaughter it for a long time. The five old stars on crutches said. It's simple, either a genius or a devil fruit taker. The five old stars wearing flat hats said lightly. Genius, devil fruit. The long-haired five old stars smiled lightly, is this important? Now we are mainly discussing how to deal with this Anfin's person, 
we have all confirmed that this guy is the murderer who killed all the nobles of this generation, how should we deal with it? So many world nobles died at once, and the whole world is watching us. All five old stars were silent. You don't think he's a good fit for what we think is the head of the intelligence agency. The bearded five old stars with a figure of eight shape said. Ruthless, forbearing, and more importantly, he has strength and talent. Quote. But he seems to have a great grudge against the nobles. His loyalty seems unreliable. The blonde five said hesitantly. It's true to have a great grudge, but then he won't kill everyone. The white robe and the five old star glasses crossed a glimmer of light and said softly. He actually has this scheming, this forbearance, he killed so many nobles, and stood on the opposite side of our world government, he knows how heavy this weight is, even if he takes refuge in Whitebeard, he may not be able to keep him, on the contrary, he takes refuge in our world government, he stands on the opposite side of the world aristocracy at most, and with our constraints, those guys in the aristocracy are blatantly afraid to do it. Quote. What's more, do we say that Anfan is the murderer? What proof do we have? He is only the only winner and survivor of this noble game. Quote. That's right. The other four five old stars were stunned and nodded, indeed, they had no evidence that Anfan was the murderer. If that's the case, then when he finally wins the competition, let him come to see us, and if he can, the position of the head of the World Intelligence Agency will be given to him. Quote. In addition, this incident can't contain the fire, those world nobles will definitely set their sights on and fan, especially the Tianlong nobles, this generation is almost all dead, more than 50 new generation Tianlong people have died, they will definitely vent their anger, what means will be used when the time comes, so we have to come forward to warn. Quote. Well, if they don't listen to us, they will still dare to take matters into their own hands, erase the names of the nobles, and put the whole clan to death. The white-robed five old stars said coldly. Our authority brooks no challenge. Quote. As the five old stars said, within a few hours of the incident, all the nobles who participated in the competition died, and the information that only an fan survived was transmitted to all the noble families. A hurricane then blew violently. One of the twenty kings, the Robert family. What did you say? The middle-aged man who was quietly reading a book in his study was stunned when he heard what the guard who suddenly appeared said, and the book fell down directly. You say, this time in the competition, Anfin is the only one alive. Said Robert Ronnie Saint in disbelief, first secretly participated in the competition, now all the nobles are dead, and he is the only one alive, what kind of rhythm is this? Anfin, that brute, don't worry about it. Ronnie Sheng frowned and waved his hand and said, he could imagine how much trouble this son would cause him, their sons were all dead, but his son was not dead, it was conceivable that an fan would become those people to vent his anger, and their family would definitely be implicated. Draco aristocratic region, one of the twenty kings, the rod magnetic family. What do you say, all the nobles are dead? Even the Domingo saint of our family is dead. A middle-aged man in a thick white suit, with hair standing up and curled at the ends, stood up in shock, and the tea in his hand was directly knocked over. Yes, a black guard nodded profusely. What, my son, cried out the middle-aged man, who immediately cried out in grief, why did my son die? Wait, you just said that there is one person alive, who is it? The middle-aged man shouted with wide eyes. It's Anfin, Robert Anfin. Quote. What, is that evil seed, why didn't he die? The middle-aged man was shocked for a moment, and then his face twisted. Once he killed my son, he killed my son, he was very resentful of us, so he killed my son on the island, I gave my son devil fruit. Wait, he doesn't have the strength to kill me and eat the devil fruit son. I don't care, why my son died, this evil seed didn't die, it's not fair, he wants to die. He wants to die, the middle-aged man roared angrily like a lion. Your Excellency Patriarch Rod Magnet, just now there was news from the world government, ordering us to privately injure all the participants. Quote. What the hell do they do? That fool said it. Don't they know that the world government is actually the stronghold of our nobles? And the death of so many world nobles, do they bear our wrath? Tell me who it is. Who is it? I'm going to kill that man. Quote. Patriarch Rod Magnet roared violently. Your Excellency Patriarch Rod Magnet, it was an order issued by the five old stars, and it was also said that if you dare to disobey the order privately, the title of nobility will be cancelled and the entire clan will be wiped out. 
said the black guard stubbornly. Suddenly, the expression of the patriarch of Rod Magnet stiffened, and he fell into the ice cellar in a fit of rage. Almost all the noble families of the celestial dragons were in disbelief when they heard the news, and they went crazy in an instant, trying to find out the reason, and they were even mad and asked the soldiers and commanders who were in charge to be buried with them. Especially when they heard that Anfan was not dead, they all shouted angrily that Anfan should also die, it is very simple, our sons are dead, why are you not dead? This is not fair. As soon as this order was issued, a basin of cold water came from an order from the five old stars of the world government. At this time, no matter how madly angry the nobles of the Holy Land Mary Hoya were, and Fan sat on the warship leisurely at this time, and the purpose was to go to the naval headquarters. This second match will take place at the navy headquarters, and all the top performers from the first 30 areas will go to the navy headquarters for the final second match. At that time, there will be admirals of the navy, the five old stars of the world government, and others will come to watch. In addition, ask for flowers, praise, and reward. With a barrel hat on his head and a simple suit with a leader, this is a clean dress that an fan has changed. Wearing this suit, with a cold face, and walking in the middle of the navy headquarters with his hands in his pants, the soldiers of the navy headquarters who don't know thought that he was the commander of the world government personnel. This is the training ground of the Navy headquarters. Because of the limited range of activities, and Fan can only go to the training ground, as soon as he arrives, he will be greeted by the momentum of martial arts, the training ground is huge, there are hundreds of soldiers training here, especially in some areas, there are school officers, and even generals are training. The whole body is strong, the fist strength is like thunder, and the momentum is amazing, a major general practiced his iron fist, and as soon as he palmed down, he saw the 10-ton boulder in front of him and smashed it. Major General Stolliberry, you're amazing. Quote, the Navy soldiers around him raised their fists and smiled loudly, as if they were doing the same. When an fan heard the name of this rear admiral, he was slightly surprised, isn't this rear admiral Thaloberg the two sword lieutenant generals in the future? This guy is a teacher who is now Admiral Z, and like Ching Z, he is also one of the students who cultivated Z. Cut, Stoloberg sneered at the sycophants, put on his major general's attire, picked up two swords, hung them around his waist, and left. Stoloberg, you walk slowly. The soldiers nodded and said in unison, and when Stoloberg had gone away, the soldiers dispersed, and each ran to the officer-level officer, and shouted in admiration. Colonel Wad, your punch is so fierce. If you punch down, even if you have a bounty of 100 million, the pirates will be killed by you. Quote, Hey, hey, don't say that about me. I'm still far away. Quote. Lieutenant Colonel, you, you scum, get out of here. Quote. Some of these colonel level officers smiled comfortably, and some disdained them and reprimanded them loudly. I see. And Fan looked stunned for a moment, and then smiled lightly, he understood. Who are you? What are you doing? Do you know what this place is? At this time, a coquettish voice came, and an Fan looked sideways slightly only to see a navy girl with pink hair, a delicate face, and a cigarette in her mouth. Look at the rank of this navy girl, it's a second lieutenant. Let me ask you, what kind of cruel are you pretending? This navy girl saw and fan with her hands in her pants and a cool look, and she couldn't wait to punch it on the spot, she hated people who pretended to be cool the most. Especially although this person lacks a mature atmosphere, he still can't hide the green face, and the young person pretends to be cold and melancholy, which can be pretended to be really good. And Fan looked at this naval girl quietly, and said in her heart that this girl seems to be the fierce girl in the future. That's right, it's her. And Fan looked at it more and more, and finally the cigarette in his mouth directly confirmed. Seeing that An Fan was still like this, Tina couldn't help but be a little annoyed, and said angrily, are you still pretending to be forced? Are you tired? Do you want to smoke with you? Ah, and Fan's expression stiffened suddenly. Seeing that and Fan finally reacted, Tina asked angrily, Who are you, what are you standing here? I'm a competitor in the Holy Land Dobby and I'm here to train. And Fan gently wiped the saliva on his face, and then said, If that's the case, then why don't you go to training and be in a daze here, do you have water as the first one? Miss Tina, I hope you don't speak so loudly, it doesn't matter if you spit on the stars, but don't spray the soot from the cigarette butt in my face, it's rude. And Fan wiped his face again and said. Ha, huh, 
Tina was so shocked that she sprayed all the cigarette ash on people's faces and hurriedly apologized to maintain the image of a lady, the image of a lady. As a result, when he saw the corners of an fan's hooked mouth, he was stunned and understood that he had been tricked. You dare to play tricks on old women. Tina looked gloomy and squeezed her pink fist. Didn't you just ask me why I didn't go to training? I want to ask, this training ground seems to be full. And Fan said with a smile, ignoring Tina's anger. At this time, Tina is really hot, and she doesn't have a mature image of the future royal sister at all. Ha, huh, Tina was stunned, looked back, and sure enough, she saw that the planned area of the training place was full, she didn't pay attention to it just now, her cheeks were a little red, forget it, it's okay, it's wrong. Anyway, this kid pretended to be the first. After a while, Tina Na's expression returned, and an fan felt inexplicable, what is the situation with this woman? And you said that my first place is a parallel import, why don't we learn from each other? I heard that you are a student of Admiral Z, and I don't know what your strength is. And Fan said with a smile. Ha, huh, said Tina frowned, she had forgotten one important thing just now, and that was that she had never introduced herself, how did this guy know her name, and that she was a student of Admiral Z? Who the hell are you? Said Tina with a stern gaze and looked at an fan with a straight face. Wearing a suit, cold, and occasionally exuding an astonishing murderous aura on his body. This is only the case with those guys in the world government. The area where the elite of the world government is trained to participate is the Holy Land region, that is, the noble region. I heard that the first game in the aristocratic area this time was extremely cruel, and the criminals released from the advanced city used it to hunt, and the one with the highest bounty accumulation was the champion, and this guy could win the championship, which means. You really have the ability to pretend to be forced, Tina said in a deep voice. Quote dot 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 quote. Anfin, looking at the frowning face in front of her, who was a little vigilant, and Fan smiled lightly. Didn't I say that? I'm here to participate in the competition at the Navy headquarters. Quote. That's not what I'm asking. I'm asking how do you know my name and knowing that I'm a student of Admiral Z, have you investigated me? Asked Tina in a deep voice. Ha, huh, you're so narcissistic. How could I possibly investigate you? We've just met, okay. Anfin chuckled. Then how do you know my name? Asked Tina who refused to let go of Anfin, still asking. And Fan is helpless, will he tell Tina that he has seen an anime called One Piece in the past and thus recognized you? Do you believe in fate? And Fan suddenly thought of a good idea. Ha, huh, Tina looked at and Fan with some confusion, but soon thought of something, and immediately realized and said angrily, do you want to fall in love with my mother? Ideographic period ideographic period ideographic period ideographic period. And Fan is stupid, this is all there and there. When you talk, you have to be disciplined, what is in love, and what is not altogether. I'm afraid you're only 11, 12, or 13 years old, and you're not even young. Ahem. I suddenly wanted to go back. And Fan said, he has lost to this Tina, hey, where is the mature demeanor of the royal sister in the anime? He doesn't know this girl Tina who is full of savage mouths and often has an old lady on her lips. You have to make it clear to me. Tina grabbed Anfin's clothes and shouted, the posture like a female hooligan. The movement on Anfin and Tina's side had already attracted the attention of the others. Who is that boy? How did you provoke this savage Nana, doesn't he want to live? Why does this kid look so much like a world government worker? It doesn't matter who he is, this guy who provoked the barbarian princess will definitely be beaten to flesh by this barbarian Diana later. Quote, Many of the Navy soldiers at the training ground stopped their training and watched and talked about it, with a tone of schadenfreude. When she was 10 years old, her parents were killed by pirates, and when she was in danger, she was rescued by Admiral Z and brought back to be a student, because she was the only female student in Admiral Z, she was deeply loved, and later served as an instructor, and almost all the generals of the later generation were his students. These senior brothers and seniors naturally take care of the young Tina. Almost all the generals in the Navy headquarters took care of her, which gradually made Tina develop bad habits such as savage smoking, of course, she was only barbaric and not savage, and she would not be barbaric for no reason. She just likes to have nothing to do and find things to do, 
her mind is full of the name of justice, patrolling and catching some scum in the Navy headquarters, especially those who are flattering and sycophants, and she doesn't say anything, she just beats them up. This kind of behavior makes some people angry but helpless, helpless and unable to say anything. It wasn't until he beat a world nobleman before that he was punished, but the punishment was also very light, lighter than ants, and he was punished by General Z for a week, which was actually just locked up in the Naval Military Academy for training. But even she still suffocates Tina crazy, she can't carry out the name of justice, and she, a week. She's crazy, coming out of Tina as directly like a lioness, just when and fan was in a daze, this was nothing, but sister-in-law Tina processed it in her mind, who Sillan thought. So and fan was sad. What are you doing? Anfin looked at Tina in shock. You have to make it clear to me. Tina looked at Anfan deadly, her eyes were extremely sharp, and Anfan's eyes were about to go blind. What are you talking about? Asked Anfan incomprehensibly. You're still pretending to be confused. Tina said angrily, grabbed Anfan's clothes with both hands, and forced the very heavy Anfan backhand to hold it. The delicate body was sharp like a female leopard in predation, turned over the horse, and rode directly on Anfan's waist, and the vigorous legs clamped, locking all his waist and hips, so that he couldn't move at all. Pressed Anfan to the ground, and then stretched out his arms like lightning, clasped his wrists, and used the means of grabbing the collarbone. In an instant, he grabbed and fan, made him unable to move at all, and was pressed to the ground. What are they doing? The onlookers watched dumbfounded, their eyeballs were about to explode, and they felt that the connection between life had been subverted. Because at this time, Tina rode on Anfin's body like a female knight. What do you mean by that? Anfin looked at Tina who was sitting on his straddle dumbfounded. There are four major areas of the naval headquarters, the headquarters fortress, the family town, the naval military academy, and the training square. The naval military academy will be temporarily occupied these days, and it is very simple, the second and final match of the Holy Land Grand Competition will be held, and there will be 30 people here. At one entrance, a major officer from the headquarters stood and more than a dozen naval soldiers were alongside him. Your Anfin. The major officer looked at the boy in front of him with the list and asked. Yes, and Fan nodded lightly, took out a document in his hand and handed it to the major officer. The information is correct and correct. The major checked, nodded, and got out of the way. Good luck, quote, and Fan walked all the way with a blank face, followed the instructions, and after a few turns, he came to a large room. Ha, huh. as soon as and Fan stepped in, Several extremely sharp gazes were projected, making him uncomfortable. And Fan frowned slightly, swept his gaze around the tower, and found that they had all arrived. The stranger is full of pride, and all of them show disdain, teenagers from 30 competition areas in the world. The first place of the Naval Military Academy in a naval uniform, a government elite in a black suit with gloves and glasses, and a young swordsman in a Taoist robe with a long sword hanging from his waist. These people all looked at Anfan with some anger on their faces at this time, everyone is here, you have been here for so long, according to a certain gauge, the strongest boss is the last to appear. And they are quite angry with Anfan himself, because Anfan has not come out of his room since he went out to lie down, and what do they think they live next door to? Air doesn't exist. What do you mean by this? Pretend to be mysterious. Everyone is the first of the new generation from all over the world. And Fan's mind turned, and he quickly figured out why these people were a little hostile to him, these teenagers, their anger is really strong. I'm sorry, I overslept and I'm late, but I shouldn't be too late. Suddenly, everyone's delicate and arrogant faces couldn't help but twitch. Moved. Boy, I hope you'd better not draw to me, or I'll kill you. A young man with surging muscles and a height of 1 meter and 8 meters tall said in a cold voice. And Fan glanced at it lightly. Looking at this body that looked like a strong adult, but with a baby face on his face, he couldn't help but hook the corners of his mouth, which reminded him of a scumbag who appeared in the first episode of A Million Cold Jokes in his previous life. What are you laughing at? The young man's eyes showed anger, this guy must be laughing at his face and height, this was a pain in his heart. Nothing. Quote. And Fan chuckled and walked to an empty spot. This teenager was enraged first laughing and now ignoring, you were really looking for death. The young man disappeared in place and rushed towards an fan, kicking him directly, and his feet whirred. The others all looked at them indifferently. 
feeling the dangerous aura behind him, and Fan paused, his eyes were slightly on one side, and a vague black shadow was kicking towards his face, and Fan reacted instantly, and crossed his fists in front of his head to protect his head. Bang! Quote, the young man's heavy kick smashed on and Fan's wrists, and the powerful force directly shook and Fan out of a foot pit, and the young man jumped back a few steps after the kick. With a hard foot on the ground, the young man stabilized his body and said with disdain, it's still a little capable. And Fan relieved the force from his wrists, and stared at the young man indifferently, this kick is really powerful. Quote, if you're willing to kneel before my lord Jacos, I'll forgive you, or else. HMPH, the boy was smug. What Jacos didn't notice was that a trace of scarlet killing intent flashed in and Fan's eyes, and a haze appeared on his face, and he dared to kill him. Exclamation mark. As soon as you make a move, you're looking for death. And Fan's heart was extremely furious. You're going to kill me, so I'm going to do it to you, so we're all fair. And Fan said indifferently. Jikos's expression froze suddenly, and he immediately became angry, and when he was about to scold a few times, and Fan turned into an afterimage and appeared in front of him. Navy 6. A hint of surprise flashed in the eyes of the young man in the navy uniform, and the rest of the acquaintances also had surprise in their eyes. Boom. Quote. And Fan shot out with a finger gun, and when he was about to pierce the skin and body of Jikos with a sharp finger, he suddenly froze. And Fan gently lowered his hand, and his eyes were indifferent to the burly man who appeared next to him, wearing a vice admiral's costume and a navy hat, and his whole body exuded a scorching aura. Jikos was in a cold sweat, and he was stunned just now. Ha! Huh, the pupils of Jikos's eyes suddenly shrank, and he trembled slightly. Sakaski, Lieutenant General Akainu. Quote, the rest of the group was shocked by the burly man who suddenly appeared. Little ghosts, have you forgotten that you can't fight privately? Akainu said coldly to Anfin and Jikos. And you, when you see a private fight, you don't stop it. Akainu shouted loudly at the others with a cold gaze, and a strong aura enveloped the entire room, and the air was hot and boiling. Everyone shed a drop of cold sweat, and Anfan also had a few drops of sweat on his forehead, but his was hot. Did you just shoot him with a finger gun? Akainu asked aloud at Anfan. He killed me. I caught it, I killed him. That's fair. And Fan turned around and said slowly. Really? Akainu asked in a cold voice, a puff of grey smoke gradually rising from his body, yours is far stronger than everyone here, you can't back down. What? As soon as the words came out of his mouth, the faces of everyone in the room changed greatly, and they lost their voices, looking at Anfan in great horror. What did you say? said Anfan as he picked up his hat and said with a blank face. HMPH, do you think I can't guess? Akainu snorted coldly, you are a person who is extremely extravagant, like a pirate, no matter what, you won the championship, but I will never agree to join our navy, the navy can't tolerate this madman of yours. Quote. And Fan stood there expressionless. Be careful in the future, don't let me take the chance, or I'll hold a funeral for you, because you're worthless in prison city. Akainu said coldly. Warning you, don't kill at least one person in this competition, or, Akainu sneered at Anfan. The race starts after 10 years. After dropping the last sentence, Akainu snorted coldly and turned to leave, leaving Anfan with a blank face and the others in shock. Akainu, I remember your words. And Fan's face turned pale, his hands clenched, and his muscles were thick, look at who is holding a funeral for whom. I'm going to kill all the contestants this time. Two games, first round, 30 into 15. Ring 1, Aldrich vs. Alger. Ring 2, Alva vs. Alventon. Ring 3, Amos vs. Hebrew. Ring 4, Jacos vs. Smoker. Ring 5, and Fan vs. Shishi Palace. And Fan was a little surprised to look at the smiling boy in a navy uniform, but he didn't expect that this boy would be the future smoker smoker. And Fan stepped into the number 5 ring, and this time he met a talented swordsman from the Dobby region of the West Sea, who was 13 years old this year. 3, 2, 1, go. The referee in the middle of the two looked at the two sides and felt that it was almost over, so he ordered the competition to start, and quickly jumped down from the ring and waited for the result. And Fan was expressionless, as if he didn't intend to take his opponent seriously, perhaps because he looked down on him at all. I know that your strength is strong, and I may not be an opponent in Shaw, but please respect your opponent. 
Shi Shi Gongli pulled out the knife at his waist and said angrily. He can be said to be the first person of the young generation on the west coast, how can he not be angry when he is treated so coldly today, although he knows that the strength of the person in front of him is unfathomable, but he also has dignity. Since you know that you are not an opponent, then why don't you admit defeat? Respect, only the strong are qualified to be respected, and the weak are just ants. And Fan looked at him indifferently, and said indifferently. That's good, prove it with your strength and gain your respect. Shishi Palace's eyes were red, he had never seen such a contemptuous person, raised the blade of the knife, and slashed towards and Fan with a single blow. The blade was surrounded by a trace of sword chi, and it was indeed a genius level person. Solo, one of the three main forces in the original book, has not yet practiced sword chi at this age. HMPH, what's the matter with genius? It's rubbish in my eyes. And Fan snorted coldly, and disappeared as well, instantly appearing in the place where he was about to walk in Shishi Palace, blocking in front of him and stopping him. Not good. Sensing a black shadow suddenly appeared in front of him, Shishi Yuan was taken aback, and for a while, he suddenly stopped his body and wanted to retreat backwards, he didn't expect and Fan's speed to be so amazing. And Fan didn't give him a chance to retreat, so he kicked it up directly, hit the stomach in the Shishi palace, and kicked it out directly. Ah, there was a tearing pain in the abdomen, and for the first time in Shishi palace, she almost lost consciousness in pain. Pong. With a loud bang, and Fan's back hit the stone pillar not far from the ring, and then slammed into the ground. Poof! A mouthful of scarlet blood spit out from the mouth of the Shishi palace, and his eyes were bloodshot as he looked at an Fan, who despised him in the ring, and just kicked him to the ground. Did your excellency just humiliate you? It's just a bunch of nonsense. And Fan disdains it, keeps saying these words, isn't it annoying? And Fan looked at the referee who was already stunned under the ring, and said, Is it possible to decide the winner? Your Excellency, in the future, I will definitely return today's shame to you, there is a sentence of thirty years. Shishi Palace looked coldly at an Fan who walked off the ring, and said angrily. Quote dot, quote, and Fan, who stepped out of the ring, raised his finger and shot out a finger gun, and the void white energy glided directly into the void, and with one finger, the head in Shishi Palace exploded like a watermelon. The referee was dumbfounded and took a breath. The other teenagers in the ring next to them also stopped fighting, looking stupid, looking at an fan with cold sweat on their faces, and the headless corpse made their hairs explode. He actually killed him. Looking at the violence in an fan's eyes, he couldn't help but think in his heart, if he compares with him, will he also kill himself? Thinking of this, I couldn't help but panic in my heart, and my confidence was all clouded. You killed him. You broke the rules. Quote, the referee stayed for a long time before he shouted angrily that he had killed someone in front of him. Kill it, kill it, why are you going to disqualify me? And Fan looked at the referee with a fierce look in his eyes, making the referee tremble. You, I'm going to, report to the chief, propose to disqualify you. Quote, the referee was shocked and angry, but there was nothing he could do, and it could be seen from the strength of the game just now that this and fan's strength might be stronger than him. Unless he dares to fight to the death, he will have a chance to defend justice with his life, but does he have the heart of absolute justice? And he doesn't dare to subdue and fan, there is only one chance. Go, Anfin smiled contemptuously and turned to leave. Leaving a rage is more than helpless referees. I hope to cancel his qualification. The rest of the participating teenagers silently prayed in their hearts, only if this and Fan withdrew, they would have a chance, if they didn't quit, they wouldn't say that they could win the championship and they might even lose their lives. Holy Land, Mary Joa. Huge warships were moored, and rows of naval soldiers or soldiers in black suits stood still with their spears in hand. Your Excellency Five Star Elder, we will go to the Navy headquarters for half an hour. Quote, Looking at the majestic red soil in front of him, a big man with red skin like a fishman said in a deep voice, Holy Land Dobby, those guys are going to the Navy headquarters to watch the game, Mary Hoya is empty, today I want to free the slaves there and completely liberate them. Headquarters of the Navy, huge warships are moored in the harbor. Your Excellency the Five Old Stars. Marshal Kongu bowed lightly to the Five Star Elder who walked down slowly, in order to show respect, and behind him, Senior General Z, Sengoku General, Vice Admiral Karp, Vice Admiral Akainu, 
Vice Admiral Chingzi, Vice Admiral Yellow Ape and other cadres of the highest combat power of the Navy headquarters all lowered their arrogant heads. The five old stars are not only the highest power holders in the world, but their unfathomable strength also makes them daunting, especially those who are more than 100 years old. Kongu, it's not bad. After getting off the ship, the five old stars looked up, the Navy headquarters was still full of majesty, solemnity, and atmosphere, looking at the energetic appearance of the soldiers of the Navy headquarters, he couldn't help but praise and praise. For the sake of world justice, it is due, Marshal Kongu said. Hum, the five-star old man nodded with satisfaction. This time, there are so many nobles from the world. The soldiers of the Navy headquarters watched that after the five-star old man got off the ship, several other warships came down one after another, many world nobles came down one after another, dressed gorgeously and with noble temperament, but the faces of many world nobles were very ugly, and they didn't know why. As the second round over now, Wu Lao Xing asked on the road. It's time to end, but there was a little accident, Marshal Kongu said. What kind of accident? asked the fifth old star, a little confused. The Akainu fist behind Marshal Kuga suddenly tightened, and a trace of anger flashed in his eyes. That Anfin's fighter actually killed his opponent in the first round, so he was temporarily locked up. Quote. Hearing this, the five old stars frowned slightly. And how did you deal with it? Haven't dealt with it yet. And waited for the instructions of the five elder stars. Quote. Hum. Get him out there and let him go straight to the third round. Quote. Yes. Let me out. And Fan rubbed his wrist and said as he looked at the naval officer and soldier who opened the door. You're ready for round three. Chingzi appeared in and Fan's eyes and said indifferently. Oh, got it. And Fan stood up, stretched, and walked out of the small dark room. Ha, huh. as soon as he came out, he saw the referee who made the report, only to see that his face was blue, his lips trembled a little, and he didn't understand why he would be fine if he broke the rules. And Fan smiled contemptuously passed by him, and stood abruptly. Don't let me take my chance, or I'll slaughter you like a pig. And Fan said softly. Suddenly, the referee's face changed drastically, his face turned pale, and he was almost scared. And Fan, Chingzi frowned slightly, and reminded loudly beside him. I'm sorry, I'm just talking about it, I don't have to take it seriously. And Fan smiled, laughed loudly and left. This is really just talking, and an fan is just scaring and scar upping. But the referee didn't see it that way, this intimidation directly shrouded a shadow in his heart, especially after an fan won the championship, he became the director of the intelligence agency of the world government, and he held a huge power than the navy, and he was even more murderous, so that he could not be afraid all day long, worried about retaliation, serious mental illness, and finally went crazy directly. You're talking too much. Chingzi walked aside and said indifferently. I'm just kidding, quote, and Fan hugged his back and laughed and said. Really, said the child, apparently unconvinced, you are very extravagant. I can't believe what a ten-year-old child should do by looking at your behavior. Quote, ha, huh. and Fan sighed, because this world is too cruel. I can only survive if I am more cruel. Do you know, I was born illustriously, I lived worse than a dog, I suffered a lot of humiliation and blame, and now I have an opportunity to rise, I naturally will not let go, because I want to give those humiliations back to those guys, anyone who stands in my way, anyone who stands in front of me, I have three words, kill. Kill, kill, and Fan's eyes smeared a trace of hideous scarlet light, and the amazing murderous aura on his body emanated. The entire corridor suddenly froze three feet, which frightened the naval soldiers who followed behind. It's amazing, how many people do you have to kill? The childish pupils dilated and stared at the violent and fan, and the things that he didn't believe in his heart had been confirmed. Ha, huh, quote, at this time, and fan suddenly smiled, and he smiled, let you be frightened, of course I will not do it to those unarmed people, unless they make a big mistake. I'm not a demon, ha ha. Anfin laughed and continued to walk forward. Ha, huh, Chingzi frowned and looked at an fan's thin back, he had a trace of killing intent in his heart just now, he was so terrifying at a young age, and he had to grow up. Such a person will surely be a great scourge in the future when he grows up, should he be disposed of now. But if he does so, he is likely to accompany himself. The five old stars seem to attach great importance to this kid. 
and it seems that what will this kid grow up like in the future, what does it matter to him? Childish hesitation, is such a hesitation, so that the young man in the future will regret it and regret it for a lifetime. Is such a hesitation, so that an incomparably terrifying demon king appears in this world. Lieutenant General Qingzi, let's hurry up. It is estimated that the game will start soon. The soldiers of the Navy headquarters behind him were stunned when they saw Qingzi Ji and couldn't help urging. Oh, good. Qingzi came back to his senses and continued to walk forward, following An Fan, but he kept staring at An Fan's back all the way, not knowing what he was thinking. In the lounge, five teenagers sat on each side, looking at each other tacitly. In the end, I'm sure I'll win the first place. A teenager in a white karate costume clenched his fists and said loudly, Cut, you trash, I'll cut you with one sword. Quote, a young man with a knife said disdainfully, with contempt in his eyes, not taking him seriously. What are you talking about? Be careful I punch you in the head. Quote, the karate boy was furious. Shut up, y'all. Believe it or not, I shot you in the head. The black-clothed young man with a flintlock pistol in his hand scolded loudly. Suddenly, the two teenagers glared angrily, but their eyes were very jealous of the gun in the hand of the black-clothed young man. I'm so sleepy, one of the fat boys muttered with a yawn. A bunch of scum, quote, smoker on the side was very disdainful of these people, and laughed in his heart. I don't know, this time the five of us are competing, how to divide the competition. There is one less person. Smoker thought truthfully in his heart, he also knew him very well about the Holy Land, but this session was fundamentally different from the past, many of them have changed, and I don't know how to compare them later. Hey, go with the flow. With my strength, I should be able to win the championship. Smoker thought to himself that he had a 70 or 80 percent chance of winning the championship, because he already knew the fighting power of the other four thoroughly, and knew that he would win every battle. As long as there is no such guy, he is done. But that guy shouldn't show up. I didn't participate in the second game, so I guess I've been locked up. HMPH. The game actually killed the opponent, it was really cruel and terrible. It's a pity, Smoker thought. At the same time, a sound of the door opening sounded, and an fan walked in indifferently. Chapter 11. Everyone looked at an fan who came in in shock, their eyes burst with tears, and they looked stupid. They felt that a desolate beast was coming in with murderous intent. What is this guy doing here? Isn't he going to be in the third round? Isn't he locked up and going to push into the city? How? Hello everyone. And Fan greeted with a chuckle. Well, hello. Everyone replied dumbfounded. Ching Ji couldn't help frowning when he saw these people being frightened. In the third round of the game, the six of you will get the number one to six in the mode of drawing. The person who draws the number one will be the first to go out to fight in the ring, and the no two to six will go up to challenge, and the winner will replace the number one on the top, and so on. Qingzi said. What? The five people were immediately shocked, and they came to a new model. The young man with a sword exclaimed, in this case, isn't number one at a loss. And Fan glanced at it slightly, and suddenly felt that this guy was a little familiar, but he couldn't remember who it was. Yes. Doesn't it mean that the person who chooses number six is the most relaxed? The first four have already consumed most of number one's physical strength. This is too unfair. Quote. It's up to your luck to be unfair. Qingzi said lightly, luck is also a kind of strength. Quote. The five of them looked at each other, they heard this kind of ridiculous speech for the first time, and they wanted to refute it, but they vaguely agreed with it in their hearts, and they couldn't say it. There are rewards for the top three. The first place is personally summoned by the five elder star elders, the second place is a natural type devil fruit sponsored by the world nobles, and the third place is a demon knife captured by the navy. Qingzi said again, throwing a bombshell. Nature-based devil fruits. A few people's eyes lit up, and they directly ignored the former and the latter, because in their eyes, the nature-based devil fruits were the most precious and attractive, the ability to elementalize themselves and possess powerful natural attack power. The five old stars have summoned them personally. And Fan's gaze moved to the first place, narrowing his eyes and not knowing what he was thinking. Lieutenant General Qingzi, may I ask what type of this natural devil fruit is? Fire, light or, Smoker asked, rubbing his hands together and salivating a little. The rest of the people also looked at the childish. Lieutenant General Qingzi, what is that demon sword? 
The young man with the sword asked in surprise, for a swordsman, there is nothing more than a good sword. Xingzi smiled lightly, you'll know when you get it. Quote, for the childish seller, the five people were disappointed. All right, let's draw, Xingzi said lightly. After speaking, with a wave of his hand, a naval soldier behind him stepped forward with a box, and immediately five teenagers rushed up and reached in and took out a small wooden plank. I hope mine is number six, no matter how bad number five is, don't number one or no. Two, quote, the five teenagers prayed in their hearts, don't take number one or number two, otherwise it will be a tragedy. Yes, I got the number four. The fat boy was the first to raise his hand and said. I got the number three. The black clothed boy with a flintlock pistol said with a mournful face. I got the number five. The boy in a white karate costume said happily and loudly. I'm number six, and it's fantastic. The young man with the knife said in ecstasy. I turned out to be number two. Smoker looked at the two feet on the small plank and said sadly. Ha ha. The karate boy laughed and said, this time I won the top three. Ha ha. Looking at the karate boy's arrogant laughter, and Fan was expressionless. Who's number one? The fat boy asked curiously. Suddenly, the eyes of several people fell on and Fan, who did not go up to draw lots. It's time for you to draw a lottery, Anfin. Qingzi said. Hearing this, and Fan smiled lightly, straightened his black hat, turned around and walked towards the entrance of the game leading to the periphery. Do I still need to smoke this? After saying that, he stepped in and out, leaving a few people in a daze. What does he mean? Asked the fat boy confusedly. Numbers two to six were all taken by us, and number one didn't need to be drawn to know it was his. Quote. Oh, that's right. Quote. The fat boy suddenly realized, and then remembered something, and said with some schadenfreude, this guy is the number one, and the number two is miserable. Quote. Everyone's eyes were schadenfreude and looked at Smoker with a bitter face. I hope you don't die. The boy with the gun said bitterly. Get out. Watching the five teenagers slowly leave, Qingzi stood there quietly. So you already know. Quote. Qingzi threw the box on the ground, and there was nothing in it. It was like a gladiatorial arena, surrounded by a large number of people, and as soon as an fan walked out, countless shouts came. And fan looked at the corners of his eyes twitched slightly, and suddenly felt that he had been greatly humiliated, and a trace of violence flashed. I'm not a monkey, and Fan clenched his fists and exhaled heavily, slowly calming his angry heart. This little one, directly above the competition venue, the five old stars sat there quietly, watching and Fan's reaction after coming out, one of the five old stars couldn't help but chuckle, what a strong self-esteem. A lot of people from the Naval Military Academy came. One of the five old stars said quietly, seeing that more than two-thirds of the spectators on the competition field were teenagers wearing naval cadet uniforms. Well, let them build up their prestige and deterrence in this generation. Marshal Kongu next to him said. Hum, the five old stars nodded. In the playing field, in the upper left aristocratic area, dozens of world nobles sat here, all quietly, all looking at an fan with disdain and disgust on their faces. If you run out to compete secretly, you must break his leg when the time comes, so that you can run. Quote. This evil seed, why does he have such good luck? The first game was all dead, but he didn't die, how can there be such great luck in the world, there must be something strange, and we must investigate it carefully when the time comes. Quote. No matter what, this evil seed must die, and secretly plot it when he is in the game later, so that he will die at the hands of his opponent. Yes, this guy is really good. Tina who was sitting in the seat was surprised and looked at an fan who was standing in the ring indifferently below. I don't know who Smoker will win against him, I hope Smoker will win, this guy was really arrogant last time. Quote. As if thinking of something, Tina blushed slightly, then clenched her pink fist and waved it fiercely. Akainu looked at an fan with a gloomy face, looking gloomy and uncertain, not knowing what he was thinking, and the yellow ape next to him muttered and looked at Akainu and then at an fan, and a smile floated up. Number one stands in the ring and accepts the challenge of number two to number six in turn, insisting on standing last as a victory, otherwise it is a defeat, and there are no restrictions on the rules of the game, the use of weapons and any means is allowed, as long as anyone falls under the ring, or is defeated and falls to the ground, it will lose. 
The warring states general stood on it and announced loudly, without saying any more nonsense, and simply announced it. The five teenagers who had already come out and sat on a row of stools a few meters away from the ring all nodded in unison. Understood. Quote, that's good. Contestant number. Two smoker is on the field. Sengoku shouted. Smoker. Tina looked at Smoker as she walked into the ring in shock, a little surprised that he turned out to be number two. Zephyr, who do you think will lose between the two of them? Kapuha laughed and asked Z, who was sitting next to him. Smoker is lost, Z said lightly. Oh, you're so sure, you're so unconfident in your student, Smoker. Not to mention his strength, he is already inferior in terms of momentum. He is doomed, I just hope that this guy named Anfin will not kill Smoker. Otherwise, I will kill his. 2. Ha ha ha. Smoker was very nervous now, and looked at Anfan, who was indifferent and quietly straight, and his heart became more and more nervous. I hope to put aside the meeting and not kill the killer, I am willing to admit defeat. Quote. Smoker bowed and said, No way. The murderous and fan has a considerable shadow in the heart of this 13-year-old boy, especially the bloody headshot seen before made him chill. And fan was slightly stunned, and then the corners of his mouth hooked slightly, this arrogant smoker in the future actually bowed his head, and he was still immature. If that's the case, then why don't you admit defeat? And fan said softly. Smoker said with a serious expression. I am afraid of death but it does not mean that I am a coward. I want to lose with dignity, not to walk out of the ring in disgrace, I want to lose, I have the ability to lose. And Fan suddenly smiled lightly, and he pushed his black cylinder hat against his fingertips. I see, you convinced me. Quote, as soon as the words fell, his figure instantly turned into an afterimage, appeared next to the shocked smoker, and kicked out. This is one of the six styles of the navy. How could he? The five old stars were a little surprised, and the Akainu and the others were also very surprised. When did he learn the Navy Six style? Rod Magnet's eyes were full of surprise and anger, not to mention how much talent it takes to rush this Naval Six style, only the government elite and the Navy elite can learn it. This evil beast actually knows the Navy Six. Ronnie Saint was shocked, and at the same time he was very puzzled. Father, how can he know the Navy Six style? I haven't learned it for so many years. Ronnie sat next to a very seven-year-old child, with his hair standing on end, and his face was full of arrogance, looking at an fan, his little eyes burned with a fierce fire of jealousy, and he seemed to be very unbalanced in his heart. No matter how surprised the people who saw one of the six types of the Anfin Navy, Anfin Below was ravaging Smoker at this time. Bang! The heavy kick slammed into Smoker's body, and the hard floor made of marble in the ring was shaken out of a crack, so you can imagine how heavy this kick was. Smoker was covered in blood, lying on the ground panting, he had many broken bones all over his body, and there were wounds all over his body, and the whole person was seriously injured, and there was still half a breath left. This guy has such a heavy hand. Tina in the audience was furious, his classmate Smoker was beaten like this, why didn't he go up to stop it? All the onlookers of the Navy military cadets were shocked, their first place in the Naval military cadets this year, Smoker was abused like this, in other words, would they be killed? This guy's strength is terrifying. Everyone looked at Anfan with great fear and admiration, that was the worship of the strong. You can afford to lose. Anfan said lightly, waved his hand slightly after speaking, turned around and slowly walked to the position before the game, sat on the ground lightly and lazily, and shouted to the four below. It's your turn. Quote, go and get that one out right away. Sengoku shouted, and several medical nurses and soldiers quickly rushed forward, and after being lifted on a stretcher, they were quickly lifted to rescue, and they were too seriously injured. Warring states frowned and looked at an fan in the ring, just now he saw that Smoker was beaten to the point where he was beaten without any power to fight back, and when he wanted to stop it, the order of the five old stars not to allow anyone to interfere came, there was no way, so he had to look at it with his eyes, fortunately, this and fan seemed to know the measure, he was not violent as the report said, he did not kill him, I hope this and fan will always be like this. Warring states is 100% sure that this and fan can win the championship, and this strength is also at the level of a vice admiral in the navy. Your students are miserable, Carp laughed. Z looked at an fan below with an expressionless face and said, he didn't make a killer, this heavy blow is a good experience for smoker. Quote, 
but your smoker is seriously injured this time and will have to lie in bed for at least a few months. Don't be so bitter, be careful that I will also beat you in bed and lie in bed for months. Quote, ha ha, quote, carp, you, quote, you're sure you want to do it. And Fan looked at Andre, who was the number three player holding a pistol, and said slowly. I'm sure, quote, Andrew gritted his teeth and said, if you can beat me by accident, I can definitely blow your head off with one shot. Quote, Arashi, quote, a pale blue vacuum wave slashed out, and Andrew looked at his separated body in astonishment, his eyes full of disbelief and dead ashes. There is no turning back when you open the bow, and you refuse to admit defeat, so let's die. And Fan put down his feet and said indifferently. It's your turn, will you admit defeat or go to the ring? And Fan's gaze turned to the frightened three teenagers, his eyes flashed, and the corners of his mouth were hooked, full of evil intent. He's a killer. Everyone in the audience was shocked to see the headless corpse whose head rolled under the stage. This is really strong, said the naval cadets. The speed was really fast, and they were killed in seconds before they even started, this person's strength was really. The strength of this evil seed. The saint of rod magnet looked shocked. My waist brother is so strong. The seven-year-old boy next to Ronnie Saint was very shocked, seeing that Infan's heart was becoming more and more jealous, and his heart became more and more unbalanced, why did such a sinister seed who was bullied by them have such a strong strength? Hee <laughs> hee, this kid. The five old stars looked at it and smiled slightly. Five star old man, this kid is really too evil, ignoring the rules of the game under the killer. Careless management of human life, such a person will definitely be a big scourge in the future when he grows up, I want to wipe him out now. Akainu couldn't bear it anymore and stood up and said loudly. The sound was so loud that it was heard all over the stadium. Everyone's eyes quietly looked at the murderous red dog who stood up. And Fan's face suddenly became a little ugly, and the faces of the three teenagers suddenly became ecstatic, if this is the case, they will take the top three, which is really good. Lieutenant Admiral Akainu, you are awesome. That's right, your excellency the five old stars, this kid has no rules of the game, wantonly kills people, and will definitely be a very evil criminal when he grows up in the future, I agree with Lieutenant General Akainu's words, and immediately execute this kid. Rod Magnet stood up and said loudly, his position as the patriarch of the family, one of the descendants of the twenty kings, was more prominent than the admiral. And as soon as he said this, the Tianlong nobles and world nobles around him agreed and said loudly. Agree, put the whole seed to death, or it will be a great scourge in the future. Quote. Immediately put. To death. Quote dot. The response of all the world nobles shocked many people, and almost all of them decided that an fan was finished. The faces of the three teenagers were even more happy, and the eyes that looked at Anfan were actually sad and sad. Anfan was expressionless again at this moment, staring at the group of world nobles with blood-red eyes, and then looked at the three teenagers with deep red eyes, and immediately met the eyes full of pity and schadenfreude. In an instant, Anfan's pupils dilated and he was full of violence. Shut up! The face of the five old stars in the white robe changed suddenly, and he roared wildly, and the sound exploded in the ears of these world nobles like thunder, and a strong momentum swept up, and the sky changed color. Who made you make a fuss here? Who made you heal here? Do you know what the rules of the game are? Do you know? Yes, there is no limit. There is no limit. The rules of the game are no restrictions. There is no problem in killing people, even if he kills people in the audience. The five old stars in the white robe roared. The faces of the nobles of the world changed drastically, and the faces of the red dogs also changed greatly, and they all quieted down one after another, looking at the five old stars with some horror. The winner of this game is decided, Anfin wins he is number one, he is the champion. The blonde five old stars with Erlang's legs crossed stood up and said lightly. Immediately, everyone's eyes looked over, and they saw an fan holding a blood-dripping knife in his hand, and three corpses lying at his feet. All the world nobles should go back and pay 100 e bailey to the world government as punishment. Quote. Rod Magnetic Saint, you go back and pay 1000 e bailey to the world government, Akainu, you kill the head of the 100 e bounty pirate as punishment. Quote. In the fortress of the navy headquarters, in the headquarters office, the five old stars sat quietly in the main seat, and on both sides sat the highest combat power of the navy headquarters, Marshal Kuga, Sengoku General, Admiral Z, Carp, etc., in turn. 
Everyone's eyes were staring at an fan who was sitting in the middle, and the whole room revealed a depression, if it were someone else, so many world bigwigs were staring at him, I am afraid that he would have collapsed long ago. But an fan was still indifferent and expressionless. Your name is an fan? Asked the blonde five-year-old, ten years old this year. Yes, quote, well, yes, a young man can be described as a young man. At the age of ten, he has the strength to be inferior to the vice admiral of the Navy headquarters. Carp interjected laughing. Carp, warring states said angrily, this old friend doesn't know how to restrain his personality at all, and he usually doesn't care, but now that the five old stars are here, he still dares to be presumptuous, not afraid of being punished. The strength and potential of the vice admiral of the Navy headquarters is very great. The five old stars on crutches muttered. And Fan, I don't care what kind of birth you are, what kind of things you have done, or how much hatred you have, I want to ask, are you willing to be loyal to the world government? Everyone's eyes were on and Fan. And Fan's face was calm, and it took a long time before he said, I do. Very good. The white-robed five old star glasses streaked across the light. A major general officer walked in with a large wooden board and placed it in front of an fan, on which was placed a devil fruit and a narrow knife with a sheath. From now on, you will be the head of the world government's intelligence agency, in charge of the CP0-CP9 agency, and in five years, if your strength reaches the rank of admiral, this agent can be removed. The white-robed five old stars said slowly. Because four died, one seriously wounded, and only you won, these prizes are all yours. Quote. The second generation of ghosts, smoke is naturally the fruit. Quote. And Fan's expression moved slightly when he listened. The second generation of Oni Che was the weapon of Rain no Harayu who advanced into the city university prison in the original book, and the smoke fruit was Smokers. In this competition, Smokers Guy was seriously injured by him and lost the game, and the Rain Harayu who was a young man with a sword was directly killed by him. What should have belonged to them has now been snatched by him before. What a knife! And Fan picked up the second generation ghost Che and gently unsheathed it, revealing the scarlet blade with red light, and suddenly a strong murderous cold intent swept through the room, most of which were aimed at and Fan and poured away. Everyone looked at it expressionlessly, and the five old stars above also watched quietly, seeing how and Fan surrendered to the second generation of the 21st generation of the big fast knife. As soon as the murderous chi eroded into the body, it was bitten and devoured by the infinite fruit devouring power in an fan's body, no matter how much murderous chi was imported by the second generation ghost che, none of it was wiped out, as if it flowed into a bottomless black hole. Surrender or perish, quote, and fan said slowly with a violent expression, and a strong murderous aura ignited, as if a calm sea was blowing a violent storm and setting off a tsunami. It's so murderous. The warring states general frowned slightly, Carp's face also became slightly serious, except for the five old starry sky GU marshals, the other people looked very serious. How many people do you have to kill to have such a fierce murderous aura? Is it a mistake to hand over the world's intelligence agencies to him? Since we have already greeted them before, everyone is not too surprised by the appointment of the important position of head of the world intelligence agency. The World Intelligence Agency CP0-CP9 is subordinate to the world government and is responsible to the five old stars, which is different from the direct command of the Navy headquarters, and the comparison between the two is too poor, and it is several levels lower. The five old stars want to choose a person with strong strength and great potential, and his identity must be a world noble, and his loyalty is absolute, so he will make the aristocratic regional competition so cruel. So everyone doesn't have much of an opinion on selecting the head of the World Intelligence Agency from the Holy Land Dobby, after all, it's not their own dish at all. Moreover, this intelligence chief is equivalent to the rank of Vice Admiral of the Navy Headquarters. It's just that because the World Intelligence Agency is directly responsible to the five old stars, his position is quite important, and sometimes, his power is greater than that of the admiral or even the marshal, and he can arbitrarily investigate some people and even execute them. Once some evidence of disloyalty to the world government is discovered, the generals and marshals can be executed, and of course loyalty to this position is definitely infallible. However, it also reflects the authority of the head of the World Intelligence Agency from the side, so what kind of character the head of the World Intelligence Agency is can determine how the future world intelligence will be. If a person who likes to kill is in the hands of this institution, 
then the intelligence agencies of this world must also love to kill. Especially this and Fan is only 10 years old and already has the strength of a vice admiral in the Navy headquarters, so he doesn't know how powerful it will be in the future. At that time, the strength of the world's intelligence agencies will inevitably swell to the level of a violent agency that is stronger than the Navy headquarters. Some people shudder when they think about it. In fact, these people have misunderstood, and Fan's amazing murderous aura is just the murderous aura that devours the second generation of ghosts, but and Fan will not say it. Surrender or perish, and Fan looked at the second generation ghost Che in his hand and said slowly again, the murderous aura on his body became heavier and heavier, and almost a trace of blood mist appeared in the air. Some people breathed in the cool air and shouted, terrible, terrible, hum, quote, finally, the second generation ghost Che hummed, but still surrendered, and the blood red blade retreated, revealing the blade that exuded coldness from the silver coal. That's good. The five old stars watched quietly from above, nodding in satisfaction, this smoke is naturally a devil fruit, so let's eat it. And Fan looked at the grey fruit in the shape of a pineapple in front of him, and immediately shook his head and said, I don't need this fruit, give it to the one named Smoker. The referee didn't judge him to lose, and he didn't admit defeat himself, so he was second. Quote. Immediately, everyone present was surprised that Fan's words actually gave up the natural devil fruit, and gave it to others, although the smoke attack is the lowest in the natural series, isn't it also the natural devil fruit? The five old stars couldn't help but be slightly stunned when they heard and fans words, and General Z was also a little stunned when they heard and fans words. If you think about it, Anfin's words are right. Smoker didn't admit defeat, and the second referee didn't judge, and this game is an unlimited game, so it seems that he really hasn't lost. Are you sure you don't want this devil fruit? The five old stars stood above and stared at Anfan. Sure, Anfan nodded, seeing Anfan's affirmative look, the five old stars agreed. Bang, bang, your excellency the five old stars. Suddenly, there was a rush of footsteps, and a government soldier in a suit ran in sweating profusely, half kneeling and shouting, your excellency the five old stars, something has happened to Mary Joy in the holy land. Holy land Mary Joa, boom, the earth began to tremble and the flames were faintly mixed with the screams of the soldiers, the roars of the people, and the cheers of the slaves. Kill them. The time for liberation has come. We are not slaves. Take up arms and resist. Burn everything. The draconians deserve to die. Long live freedom. Kill them. What the hell is going on? Soldier. Soldier. Where's my soldier? Oh no, my lord, all the slaves have been released. What? How did they all get out? What did that waste do they eat? The current situation, I don't know yet. You waste hurry up and contact the Navy headquarters, now most of the combat power in the Holy Land has gone to the Navy headquarters. Quote. Yes, yes, ha ha ha, kill these fools, we are free, draconians are moths, kill these fools. More than a dozen slaves wearing prison uniforms with knives and special marks on their heads appeared, looking at the fat Draco and the soldier with scarlet and extravagant eyes. What do you untouchables want? No, don't. A terrible sound sounded, and the blood of the scarlet nobles stained the noble land here. A riot of slave emancipation was launched. Everyone, run, don't fall in love here, once the strong man of the navy headquarters returns, he will not be able to escape. Quote. A man with dark red skin, muscular body, blood all over his body, panting heavily, and holding a huge toothed knife fish in his hand, shouted loudly. This fishman is the director of this slave liberation, and the adventurer who climbed the Red Earth continent with his bare hands and entered the slave prison to free all the slaves, Fisher Tiger. Tiger shouted loudly, he knew that this time the slaves could be successfully freed because the powerful people of the world government stationed here had gone to the navy headquarters, and once they learned the news and rushed back, more than ten times as many slaves as they were now would be slaughtered. Therefore, before the world government powerhouses have reacted, flee quickly. But no matter how much Tiger shouted, this group of slaves who had been blinded by years of hatred had gone mad, and they wanted revenge and anger, and they took weapons and killed the members of the aristocracy in the Holy Land Mary Joy, and the horrific killings were provoked, and a scene of scarlet blood was staged everywhere. These guys, Tiger looked very ugly, and his fists clenched. Tiger let out a deep breath and looked back at the small group of people who were desperately trying to escape. Bang! Suddenly, a loud crash sounded, 
followed by several more crashes. Tiger looked at it for a moment, and saw several large warships with seagulls directly hitting the shore, and countless Navy and government soldiers rushed over. Oh no, the people from the world government have arrived. Tiger's face changed drastically, and he immediately waved his hand and shouted, the people of the world government are here, everyone run. Quote, what? All the slaves stopped their killing, looked over, and saw crowds of Navy and government soldiers flying towards them, shooting at them. Bang! With a gunshot, a slave was shot directly in the mouth, and fell to the ground unwilling to die. The Navy and the government are coming, everyone run, or they will be killed. Quote, Fearful voices shouted, and all the slaves dropped their weapons and ran in panic, all forgetting the direction Tiger had shown them. Boom! Suddenly, a huge magma fell from the sky, and more than a dozen unresponsive slaves were corroded by the terrifying heat on the spot, screaming in pain and dying. I saw a red dog wearing a righteous navy uniform and a hat appear step by step, and a terrifying smoke rose from behind his back. All the slaves who came out this time were killed, and not a single one should be spared. Akainu said with a gloomy face. A large number of soldiers appeared around began to surround those slaves and began to deal with the blood, a large number of unwilling miserable sounds sounded, and the blood of the scarlet slaves once again flowed all over the noble land, and the blood of those nobles was not separated from each other, and everyone's blood was the same. Run, quote, there was only a small group of slaves on the periphery of the soldiers, and that small part of the slaves who had been running to listen to Tiger from beginning to end, and they were desperately trying to run forward, especially when they saw the navy and government soldiers arriving, they all wished they had a few more pairs of legs. Oops, quote, among the small group of slaves, a black-haired girl suddenly accidentally dragged her foot to a stone and fell to the ground. Sister, it's okay. A green-haired girl and an orange-haired girl hurriedly stopped, and the people who ran away subconsciously stopped and took a closer look. It's fine, the black-haired girl shook her head and said as she stood up again. It's okay, let's run quickly, and we'll be overtaken by the soldiers. One of the slaves said. Well, let's run, the brunette nodded, I'm afraid you don't have a chance. Quote. A hoarse voice sounded immature and slightly mature. Everyone was shocked and when they looked at the voice, a young man with a height of 1 meter 6 appeared in their eyes, wearing a suit and a hat, and a knife hanging from his waist. This young man looked like an fan, who had been ordered by the five old stars and a kainu to suppress together, and he walked slowly, looking at the slaves with a cold expression, who were about 50 or so slaves. I almost let you escape. And fan said indifferently. Who are you? Get out of the way, or they'll kill you. Quote, one of the slaves shouted violently, the knife in his hand trembling. Kill me, and Fan smiled contemptuously when he heard this, and looked at the slave who spoke, covered in a foul smell, and looked decrepit, in stark contrast to the beautiful black-haired girl behind him. Ha, huh. and Fan's eyes suddenly narrowed, and he looked at the black-haired girl carefully, he felt that this girl was a little familiar, and there were green-haired girls and orange girls standing on the left and right next to him. Suddenly, and Fan knew that the black-haired girl was the one. At this time, the black-haired girl trembled and looked extremely frightened. The corners of Anne Fan's mouth hooked slightly, revealing a playful smile. What are you laughing at? What are you laughing at? I don't want to go back. I'm going to kill you. Poof. Quote. A huge flying head accompanied by soaring blood. And Fan fused the six styles into his whole body, and beheaded the slave with the land feet used by his hands. Everyone looked stupid all at once. Your Excellency Anfin, quote. At this time, more than 20 government soldiers in suits who were chasing after him came, and when they saw An Fan, they immediately saluted. Hum, An Fan nodded, staring at these fears indifferently, his whole body began to tremble, full of desperate slaves, his hand was lightly placed on the second generation of ghosts, and his pupils dilated. Kill everybody, yes, poof, quote. A flash of silver light flashed, and blood overflowed. What's your name? asked Anfin to Ghost Che as he gently inserted his scabbard back into the scabbard and whispered to the black-haired girls. My name is Boya Hancock. Quote. My name is Boya Santasonia. Quote. My name is Boya Marigord. Quote. The black-haired girl trembled, her pupils shrunk and shrunk as she looked at the slaves and government soldiers around her, all but them, and there was some disbelief that this teenager would kill everyone but only let them go. Boya Hancock, it's you. Anfin said with a chuckle, 
standing in front of Hancock, pinching her pretty chin, lifting it up slightly, and looking at the little face that seemed to be finely carved, and the big watery eyes. It's beautiful. It's really not a loss. It's the world's first beauty in the future. And Fan couldn't help but praise. Suddenly, Hancock's cheeks flushed. You're going to be my wife, you know. Ha. Huh. Hancock was stunned and looked at Anfin stupidly. You go quickly, you won't be able to escape when those people come, and my name isn't Fan, you have to remember. Quote. And Fan turned around and said. Hancock watched Anfin leave in a daze, and then quickly ran quickly with his two sisters, and the journey was very smooth, without any soldiers chasing after him, and successfully got on the Rayleigh boat that assisted Tiger in freeing the slaves. The beauty has to be held in her hand, but her future must also be the same as the original book. And Fan said softly, suddenly stopped, looked up at the Holy Land Mary Hoya who was on fire, and his eyes began to be a little indifferent. Smack, quote, there was a sound of stepping on a tree branch. Ha, huh, and Fan frowned, his eyes immediately turned like lightning, and he said coldly, who? Come out quickly, otherwise there will be no mercy. Quote, don't, quote, as soon as the words fell, a crying lorry voice sounded, and I saw a timid blonde lorry slave head exposed next to a big tree. Who are you? My name is Kara, don't kill me, said the blonde lorry with tears in her eyes. Please, don't kill me, please, Kella pleaded, her big black and white eyes rolling with tears in her heart. Kara, and Fan raised his head slightly, and looked carefully at the little girl who was crying and trembling, this move frightened Kella, thinking that he was going to kill him. Because she saw the scene of Anfan's cruel and bloody murder before, she thought it was a murderous demon. Please, don't kill me. Corla fell to her knees in fright and began to cry loudly, please. Quote. And Fan frowned when he looked at it, and he was very unhappy about Kella's kneeling, especially crying and begging while smiling, what is this? Don't worry, I won't kill you. Anfan said, he also knows about Kara. Looking at the plot information of One Piece, Kara has been trafficked by traffickers to the Draco people since she was a child to make efforts, and has been abused by the Draco people for a long time, and is completely accustomed to the lifestyle of a slave, and can only greet anyone with a smile, afraid of being killed, and will subconsciously kneel on the ground when she is maliciously abused, pressured, or suddenly nervous and at a loss. He had been very pitiful to this poor little girl in his previous life, and now how could he make a move to kill Kella? Please don't kill me, I'm willing to be a cow and a horse. Dot 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 quote. Kella knelt on the ground and smiled and wept, because her nerves were tense just now, and she was afraid of being killed when she ran away, and she happened to see Anfin's bloody murder scene again, and then she was discovered, so she was now directly in extreme fear, so she didn't even hear what Anfin said clearly just now, and she was afraid that there was a thought in her heart that, she was going to be killed, she was going to be killed. And Fan looked at the frowning brows, shook his head, and directly slashed her hand without hesitation, knocking her unconscious. Don't go to the Revolutionary Army in the future, stay with me in the world government. Anfin sighed as he looked at the unconscious Kara on his shoulder. It was really cruel to be tortured as a slave at such a young age. And Fan shook his head, turned around and prepared to leave, just took a step his footsteps suddenly leaked, and his slightly soft face suddenly became extremely indifferent. And Fan's eyes were cold and looked at the burly middle-aged man with a hat five meters away, the middle-aged man was wearing a red coat and a navy military uniform and windbreaker, holding his arms with both hands, revealing a strong scorching aura all over his body. Akainu, you're in my way. And Fan said indifferently. Anfin, who is on your shoulder? Is it a slave? Akainu asked in a cold voice. And Fan looked at the red dog indifferently and said, she is not a slave. Quote. Not a slave. Akainu smiled coldly. No, that's a slave. Quote. There is no forgiveness for slaves. This is the order of the five old stars, what? Are you going to disobey? Akainu said coldly, kill this slave, I can be seen as anything, otherwise, I have the right to kill you together for the crime of covering up the crime of the slave of sin. Quote. And Fan suddenly showed a sarcastic smile on his face, even if you kill me together, do you have the strength? Quote. What did you say? Akainu's face changed, and black smoke burned all over his body. And Fan sneered and looked at the red dog, his fingers moved slightly, and a wave of telekinesis instantly suspended the sleeping Kella into the air, and then sneered, 
you have been making trouble for me again and again, just like a wild dog. Do you dare to say that you are not a wild dog? Good. The red dog looked iron blue, and even his head was repeated, stubborn, sheltering slaves, full of filth, filth and in need of righteous cleansing. Quote. With a roar, his right hand began to lava, and his entire palm and forearm turned into gurgling magma, and thick smoke rose and emitted an astonishing heat. And Fan snorted coldly, the second generation ghost was out of the sheath, and the killing intent was boiling, he had long wanted to see this red dog who already had the strength of a general, and how powerful the magma fruit was. Die, filth needs the baptism of justice. Quote, boom, quote. A kainu roared, a punch erupted, billowing smoke rose into the sky, and the red viscous liquid fist struck and fan. Everywhere you go, the lawn is gone, the land is dry, and the heat is staggering. It's worthy of a magma fruit. And Fan squinted his eyes and said, the second generation ghost in his hand slashed away like a poisonous dragon, and the sharp sword light tore through the air, rushing towards the magma fist with a rapid whistling sound. Boom, poof, the moment the gas slurry met, a huge shockwave energy erupted, and the black and white smoke rose up and spread in all directions. HMPH, quote, and Fan snorted coldly and disappeared in an instant. When the figure appeared, it was already behind a kainu. Finger robbery, machine gun. Quote, poof, and Fan's speed was so fast that a kainu couldn't react, and his sharp fingers quickly hit countless fingers and stabbed into a kainu's chest, and countless small holes were punched in an instant. That's good. Akainu sneered, don't you know that I'm a natural powerhouse? Hum. As soon as Akainu finished speaking triumphantly, the pupils of his eyes immediately dilated, a little incredulous. How are you? Akainu Shang's mouth ached, looking at Anfan in disbelief. Bang. Quote. Anfan slammed out with one kick, and with one kick, he shook the red dog a few meters away, and sneered in his heart, the additional attack of telekinesis is really effective, and it can cause damage to the natural system. Quote, his infinite fruit has the three major abilities of devouring, replicating and fusing it, his devouring can not only devour other people's ability energy, but also memory, such as comprehension and other abilities, 1 plus 1 equals 2 plus 1 is equal to 3, devouring dozens of people, what can be learned, others learn things with one brain, his dozens of superimposed brain learning things, some aspects of an fan are already comparable to demons. He used the all-round perception of the devoured devil fruit, and found that the telekinesis of the mental power fruit was a type of spiritual power, and domineering was also a type of spiritual power, so he boldly assumed that telekinesis and domineering should be the same in nature. Sure enough, and Fan's guess was correct, but it was also incorrect, if he was domineering, he could directly kill the red dog with the blow just now, but the telekinesis addition could only hurt the red dog, and the damage caused was not great. This made Anfan a little regretful, he couldn't replace domineering with telekinesis, or he still had to awaken domineering to be king. Anfan looked at the red dog with cold eyes, count your luck and I can't kill you now. You can actually be domineering. Akainu looked at Anfan in disbelief, the pain in Shang's mouth made him think that he was attacked by domineering, because he couldn't think of anything else that could hit the natural elementalized local, and the natural Akainu thought that Anfan would be domineering. This sinful and fan can be domineering, how old is he now? He is already so powerful now, if he is allowed to continue to grow, he will have to, no. He can't be allowed to continue to grow like this, and he must be stifled from this growing cancer. Akainu looked at an fan with murderous intent, but he was very surprised in his heart. Judging from the fact that the pain in Shang's mouth didn't really hurt him, it seems that this and fan hasn't fully mastered the domineering. Akainu's eyes suddenly narrowed slightly, and he judged indifferently in his heart. Seeing the difference in the red dog's expression, and Fan immediately understood what he was thinking, and a sarcastic smile suddenly appeared at the corner of his mouth, and said, extremely stupid, a stupid wild dog. What did you say? Hearing in Fan's humiliation, Akainu's eyes instantly widened, and he was angry, and his fists jumped and clenched. I said you stupid dog. And Fan sneered coldly, he didn't tell the red dog that he was injured by his telekinesis, but this wild dog thought it was domineering, so continue to think it. What are you talking about? Akainu's eyes were red, and the killing intent was accompanied by the blazing air current. Are you deaf? Disappear the sins you have swelled with me. Akainu roared angrily, and the magma in his right arm suddenly expanded and rolled, 
turning into a huge lava fist, running towards and fan with great momentum. Hades dog, quote, Anfin dodged the speech fist with a quick blitz, and leapt high into the air. Mooncloth, quote, Arashi chaos, Lanjiao wheel, Lanjiao chop, Lanjiao liangwa. And Fan's feet had turned into shadows, and countless white blades struck a kainu like a cutter, and a kainu was forced to defend. Ah, a kainu's eyes were bloodshot, and he was hit by countless Lanjiao's attacks, and every pain would stimulate his head more and more, and he was actually pressed and beaten. He, the one who ate the top magma devil fruit in the natural system, shocked and killed countless evildoers, and was actually pressed and beaten by a ten-year-old hairy boy. If this thing gets out, he will be laughed at by others. You sin, give me enlightenment. Quote, Akainu roared, his face was hideous, and he waved his arms into the sky, and the lava on his arms turned into meteors and rushed into the air. Boom, and Fan frowned, Lan stopped, and the second generation ghost in his hand slashed out, and a half moon arc shaped red energy tore through the air, destroying the nearest tumbling meteor magma. Grabbing the vacant space, and Fan Yu walked and dodged, dodging the menacing magma meteor swarm. Ha, huh. in the process of penetration, the blazing breath on the magma meteor almost burned and Fan's cheek, but fortunately he avoided it, but despite this, and Fan's right cheek burned red, after all, the temperature above this magma meteor was 7 or 800 degrees. It's so hot. And Fan touched his face, looked at the red dog and said indifferently, I hope you don't break the phase, otherwise I will kill your whole family of wild dogs. Quote. Look at who kills whom. Akainu roared, slamming his fists to the ground. Boom. Countless magma erupted from the ground, and An Fan's side was the densest, and all the magma seemed to have eyes, surging towards An Fan. The sky is over, come to the ground again. And Fan sneered, and the second generation ghost in his hand thrust down vigorously, a scarlet light flashed, and suddenly a huge shock wave burst out. Boom, quote, with Anfin as the center, the earth exploded in all directions with the shockwave energy, and the raging magma was blocked and forced to retreat. Akainu's hideous face twitched slightly, and his right fist was clenched, ready to attack. Hum, moon shaving, and Fan's expression moved slightly, and he disappeared in an instant. Boom, quote dot. The moment and fan just moved, the red Inu's sharp move also struck out, a huge right fist composed of magma, burning with blazing black smoke, the momentum shook Hayorin as if the position and fan was standing just now fell quickly, and in an instant there was an earth-shattering bang, a huge crater. The fiery magma liquid inside boiled with a trace of bubbles, and the entire crater was filled with a thick black smoke containing great poison. Akainu gasped slightly, revealing a sinister smile, this move he used 12 points of strength, it was a large-scale killing. Indeed, if an fan hadn't dodged away quickly just now, it is estimated that there would not even be ashes under this blow. What are you laughing at? Quote, an icy voice pierced through his back. Quote exclamation mark exclamation mark quote. The cold hair on the red dog's whole body exploded all at once, and he subconsciously turned sideways to dodge. It's so unfair to have attacked me so many times, it should be given me once. And Fan said coldly. Finger gun. Pull. Finger gun. Three pulls. Finger gun. Fire pull. Finger gun. Whip. Countless fingers shot like machine guns, all hitting the target, knocking Akainu's body through countless holes, revealing the magma inside. Ah, Akainu was furious, feeling the pain in Shang, he was so angry that he was hit again. Inu Red Lotus. Akainu struggled to turn his arm from lava into the shape of a dog, and rushed forward at an extremely fast speed. Sure enough, it's a wild dog. Every trick has something to do with dogs, and they grew up eating dog milk. Quote. And Fan looked at the magma in the form of a dog and sneered coldly. Lanjiao Zhou Zan. And Fan immediately slashed out dozens of foot knives, and the powerful cutting force divided the magma into several parts. Just as an Fan smashed this dog-shaped magma, Akainu raised his fists that had completely turned into magma, and the void struck, and two magma bullets separated from his fists and shot straight at Anfan, who was once again in the air. Arashi spiral white blade. Anfan snorted coldly, and the foot knives converged into one piece in a rotating state, turning into a white whirlwind white blade, tearing the surroundings. Poof. The two magma bombs were directly shattered by the Hangchung. I can't help myself with this kind of attack, Let's play the momentum you just had. 
and Fan Yubu looked down at the red dog from the sky and said indifferently. Looking at the extremely contemptuous and Fan, the red dog with red eyes full of self-esteem, very angry and annoyed, he roared angrily. Dirty sins, to be washed away with justice, justice needs blood, you have completely angered me, I want you to see the power of the top magma devil fruit belonging to the natural system, give me fear. Boom, boom, Akainu punched out one punch at a time, the speed became faster and faster, and slowly, the magma bombs became denser, and at this time, the weakness belonging to Anfin also began to gradually manifest itself, from attacking to smashing magma bombs to more and more magma can only be dodged. And Fan, who was flashing in shape, like a paper dodge, a sense of danger came to his heart. Ha, huh, and Fan's eyes narrowed suddenly, and when he turned around, he saw that the flashed magma exploded in the air, like a meteor volcano, and the power of the explosion was huge. And Fan Yu walked quickly and immediately. Phew. At this time, a magma bomb suddenly attacked, and Fan couldn't dodge, so he had to be slashed out by the second generation of ghosts, and the magma bomb was shattered in an instant, but there were still a lot of scattered magma star chips splattered out, which made and Fan's cheeks hurt again. And Fan covered his cheeks and looked at Akainu with violent eyes. At this moment, Akainu's entire person suddenly turned into a cloud of lava, rushing into the sky and attacking and Fan, with a very astonishing speed. And Fan's eyes narrowed, and he sneered, Why, do you think that you can say that you are a turtle by putting on a turtle shell? Wild dogs are wild dogs, and they can't change their eating shit. Quote. I'm going to rip your mouth apart. Quote. The hideous voice of the red dog sounded, and the flames on the magma skyrocketed. I hope you have the ability. And Fan said coldly. A little under his feet, his body instantly rioted, holding the second generation ghost Che with both hands, the void shook violently, and a huge red light slashed out, dazzling to the extreme. Boom. A loud roar resounded throughout the sky, and the scarlet light stained the sky red. Bang. With a heavy crash on the ground, and Fan smashed on the dry ground, a trace of blood flowed from the corner of his mouth, and he didn't know how many ribs were missing. It's really a wild dog. Quote. And Fan stood up with difficulty, holding the second generation of ghostly right hand, blood flowed wildly, and said coldly towards the red dog who was ten meters away with blood all over his face. In the air behind and Fan, a sleeping little girl hung quietly, her whole body was safe and sound, and she was not harmed at all. You protected that slave and let yourself be devastated. What a foolish sin, Akainu said coldly as he looked at Anfan. Just now, Akainu's target was not Anfan at all, it was Kella, who wanted to kill Kara, and when Anfan discovered his intentions, it was too late. It was impossible for Anfan to watch the poor little girl Kara die in front of him like this, and there was no choice but to block Akainu's move, which caused him to suffer a heavy blow. But Anfan is not easy to mess with, when he was hurt, he didn't forget to give Akainu a move, a blow full of resentment, I don't know what's going on, I actually hurt Akainu and beat him all over the blood. Thinking about it now, it is estimated that he was angry just now that he moved the unawakened domineering spirit of the body, thus hurting the red Inu, and Fan regretted it very much, why did he only come with one punch, if he came with a knife, the red dog's head would probably be cut off. Ha ha, you don't have the power to backhand now. Akainu looked at Anfan with a cruel smile, he was forced so hard by Anfan just now, although it didn't cause much damage, but it made him feel that this was ten times more humiliating than being injured, just like a boxing master being played by an ordinary person, this kind of grievance is only known to him. I'm going to kill you and that little slave together, you filthy and sinful, and it takes the justice of blood to wash it away. Akainu said fiercely, his fists clenched. Before I die, can I say one last word? And Fan said suddenly. Akainu was stunned for a moment, but he didn't expect and Fan to say this suddenly, and he immediately said fiercely, HMPH. Last words, you sin full of filth doesn't need a last word, so you better die. And Fan sneered and looked at the red dog repeatedly, kill me, isn't it too late? Quote. As soon as the words fell, a yellow-colored figure suddenly appeared in front of Akainu, and kicked Akainu away with a heavy punch. Oh Lolo, you're terrible. I'm scared of all the... A tall man with a hat, dressed in a suit with light southern stripes, with a beard on his face and one eye in his mouth, appeared and said softly. Yellow ape. Akainu's violent pupils shrank slightly, 
and he said in a cold voice, What do you mean, do you want to stop me from cleansing my filthy sins? Yay, you're amazing, I'm not your match. The yellow ape spread his hands and smiled, puffing out a puff of smoke from his cigarette, which clearly did not take the red dog in his eyes. You, Akainu hated. Oops, your action blockbuster has alarmed the five elder stars, and now they want to see the results of your action blockbuster. He he he, I hope you don't get sent to mine. He he he. The gate of the headquarters of the world government. And Fan and Akainu both walked out with cold faces. What did you two fools just do, kill each other? Tell you to suppress the slaves of the rebellion, and you have suppressed each other, why? Are you two also slaves? One is a vice admiral, and the other is the incoming chief of intelligence, and they actually made a big move on the holy place of Mary Joy, the headquarters of the world government, and fought for the death. Lose the face of the world government. Vice Admiral Akainu, your headquarters, is suspended, and he will go to the New World Navy G1 Fortress as the commander, and if you can't kill 100 e-bounty pirates, don't come back. Quote. And Fan, your intelligence chief has temporarily suspended his post and gone to Jinjin City to serve as the chief guard, give me a good reflection for one year. The five old stars looked at the red dog and an fan below with iron on their faces, and said coldly. TNND, who dared to fight privately, both of them were injured all over their bodies, what a reversal. My words don't make sense. Quote, nope, nope. HMPH, let me go down. Quote, wait. Anfin, your little girl will be left to us for the time being, go down. Good luck for you this time, I won't let you go next time no matter what. Akainu looked at Anfan coldly and said hatefully. Next time, Anfan snorted coldly, do you think there will be another time? Next time is when I stew dog soup. After speaking, Anfan glanced at the red dog with disdain, and left quickly. Akainu clenched his fists and looked at Anfan's departing back with anger on his face. We are not done with your sin. This is just the beginning. A stuffle of black smoke rose from his fist. After a night of brutal repression, all the slaves were slaughtered, the blood staining the land scarlet, and the smell of blood in the air. The statistics came out, and 11, 2,617 people died, of whom 9, 63, 05 were slaves. Are the newspapers all printed? It's already printed. Quote. Well, send it all over the world at once. This matter can't be hidden, only by taking the initiative to control the hands of the world government, then you can righteously crusade against Fishman Island and completely kill the fish man. Yes, quote, on the second day, the eastern sky revealed the white of the fish's belly, and a pale red gradually rose. Ah, countless seagulls flew in the sky and flew all over the world, scattering newspapers and money on various islands. Shambord Islands. Hey, I'm mistaken. There were fishmen who secretly went to the holy land of Mary Hoya to release the slaves, and led a riot to kill people on it. How is this possible? The holy land of Mary Joy, but above the headquarters of the world government, how can it be possible to allow the slave rebellion to kill people with impunity? Said one person in surprise with the newspaper in his hand and a cold sweat. You idiot, didn't you see that the five elder star elders of the world government and the patriarchs of the major celestial dragon clans, the main combat forces all went to the navy headquarters to watch this year's Holy Land competition. But, the Holy Land Dobby has been held for so many sessions, and I have never seen such a person as the world's super combat power such as the five elders of the world government go to watch the game. The man wondered. You idiot, it is said that this session is the selection of the head of the World Intelligence Agency. Quote. Ah, for my own sake, it was a ten-year-old boy who won the championship, named Anfin. Ten-year-old, boy, you're me. You, look down on your own. Look so slowly, the newspaper above also says that Anfan won the first, second and third places in one fell swoop, oh my god. This guy actually killed all the contestants. What, it's amazing. In an unknown tavern, a middle-aged man with glasses and a scar on his eye put down the newspaper, looked at the three flower girls and several men in front of him, and said with a smile. An island in the new world. Three huge pirate ships stop here. An unusually large man with a white beard curled upwards in the shape of a crescent moon sat on a chair with a strong aura all over his body, and he was the strongest man in the world, Whitebeard Edward Newgate. Goo la la, funny, so funny. Goo la la la. Whitebeard laughed as he looked at the newspaper in his hand. 
slave revolts are wantonly slaughtering, and the world government is playing with words. Gu Lala, slaughter in the holy land of Mary Joa, kill well. Those noble and lowly world nobles will also have today. I didn't even participate, it's a pity. Quote, My sons, from today onwards, Fishman Island will be our territory, and if the navy invades Fishman Island, what will we do? Whitebeard said to the countless pirates in front of him. A certain island on the great voyage. A man in a black trench coat, with hair, and a straw hat in his hand, stared blankly at the newspaper in his hand, suddenly seemed to feel something, was slightly startled, and raised his head. I saw a man with eyes like eagle's eyes and a big sword slowly walking in. Why do you keep bothering me? Quote, Pilgrims, don't talk nonsense, compete with me with the sword, if you win, I promise not to entangle you in the future, otherwise, you will always be my sparring partner. Quote, I'm dizzy, there are so many swordsmen in the world, why do you have to look for me? Pilgrims covered his face and said in a mournful voice. I can afford you, Hawkeye said coolly, holy. Pilgrims stared blankly at Hawkeye and held back two words for a long time. It's been three days, quote, sitting quietly in the room, and Fan said silently. Because and Fan's injuries were a little serious, the five old stars asked him to recuperate for half a month before going to the city to take office, and during this time, he has been living in the assigned world government personnel house, constantly using his super brain, Navy Six styles and swordsmanship, and constantly streamlining and developing, just like a martial madman. However, and Fan devoured the recovery fruit, and the serious injuries on his body were almost healed in only three days, but his right hand was a little disadvantageous, and it didn't seem to be completely healed. Bang bang. At this moment, there were several knocks on the door. What's the matter? And Fan opened the door, his brows furrowed, and when he saw a world government official, he asked in a cold voice. Lord Anfin, a rear admiral has something to look for you. The government personnel were frightened by An Fan's impatient tone, Nima, he knew that this was a murderous master. And Fan turned his head to look at the Major General and asked, I don't know what this Major General is looking for me. You are An Fan. The Major General looked at this ordinary boy, but he was just a little cold, how could he not look like the bear child who was said to kill people without blinking? And Fan looked at the Rear Admiral coldly, because of the relationship between the Red Dogs, he now disliked the Navy very much. Tell me something, and Fan asked coldly. My name is Jair, and I have received an order from the Elder of the Five Elder Stars to escort you to Advanced City. Because of the unexpected situation, we will set off ahead of schedule. The Major General looked at him with a chill in his heart and hurriedly said. And Fan stood on the deck and looked indifferently at the sea in Wynan, although he didn't like the smell of the sea breeze. Major General Guile, what's that? And Fan's eyes suddenly saw a very strange one on the Navy warship. Lord Anfin, it was Lord Vegapunk who invented a machine capable of crossing windless belts. Major General Gyur said. Speaking of Vegapunk, a grateful expression was evident on Major General Gyal's face. Isn't it? In the past, crossing the windless zone was simply a death-seeking act, but they were the Navy, and they had to occasionally go down the windless zone. What kind of place is the windless zone, the base camp of the Sea King Beasts? Most of the people who go there are dogs beating meat buns, and there is no return. Over the years, the Navy's casualty rate has increased from 30% to the windless zone, which is a complete nightmare for people in the past. Well, now that the world government has discovered a super genius scientist, Vegapunk, and found a way to pass through the windless zone, their mother will not have to worry about passing through the windless zone and becoming the ration of the Neptune beast from now on. Vegapunk, and Fan was slightly stunned, remembering the mysterious scientist in the original book who is 500 years ahead of today's science and technology, and is known as a scientist who surpasses human intelligence for 500 years. 500 years ahead, and Fan's eyes narrowed slightly, not knowing what he was thinking. Hey, the door of justice has arrived. And Fan looked up and saw the huge gate of justice, which had already opened at this time, and the warship drove in without hindrance. No matter how many times you look at it, you will feel that it is majestic. And Fan raised his head, looked at the slowly moving gate of justice, and sighed. I don't know how this gate of justice was built, and according to Fan's scientific and technological ability in his previous life, it is estimated that he will not be able to build such a huge gate in the Pacific Ocean. 
The warship entered and followed the current to the next gate of justice. After about an hour, the warship reached the next gate of justice, and Rear Admiral Gear asked the Signal Corps, who had hurriedly rushed over to issue a report, have you made contact with the advanced city? We'll just have to wait a moment. The signal man nodded. We will cross the windless belt later, and although we will always pass the method safely, we must not be sloppy. Major General Gear was a little uneasy, and ordered again, for some reason, he had some uneasy premonitions in his heart, as if something would happen when he crossed the windless belt, which was really strange. Yes, the soldier went down, but he didn't take the order of Major General Gear seriously, and he just had to do it later. As time passed, this door of justice, under the loud, roar, slowly opened a crack in the door that allowed the warship to pass. Suddenly, a beast-like aura surged out and spread around. Feeling this momentum, and Fan's eyes narrowed consciously, and the second-generation ghost in his hand moved slightly. Lord Anfin, don't worry, Major General Gear said. Because the Sea Kings have their own territory, exuding coercion and coercion to determine who is the territory of this place, and do not cross the boundary, so they will have this strong beast atmosphere. Really, and Fan was a little surprised, was this the reason? But why, he felt as if he was about to enter a tiger's den, as if he was being targeted by a bunch of tigers, and his cold hair exploded. After entering this door of justice, there is no wind belt, and the sailors in the control room open the pulley. Bang, there was calm on the warship, except for the sound of pulleys flapping against the sea, and in Fan's eyes were fixed on the surrounding sea. It's not dangerous yet, but why am I feeling more and more uneasy? And Fan closed his eyes, spread around with a telekinetic net, felt the surroundings to the maximum, and found that there were no sea kings at all. Lord Anfin, don't be nervous. One lieutenant laughed, a mockery in his eyes. And Fan's eyes suddenly froze. Get out, quote, kicked the lieutenant into the air. Ah, the lieutenant spat out a mouthful of blood, his head slightly buried, his hat hiding his resentful eyes. What a violent bear child. Major General Gear bowed his head in shock, he didn't dare to get the announcement back for the lieutenant and Fan felt more and more uneasy, his whole body tensed up, and his hand rested on the handle of the second-generation ghost knife. As the warships went deeper and deeper, a thick fog gradually rose on the sea, and they hung in the air, causing everyone to be unable to see the surroundings clearly and even greatly hindered the navigation. But fortunately, there is a permanent pointer to advance the city, and it will not lose its way at all. Bang, ha, huh, suddenly there was a small sound of something hitting the guardrail, and when a navvyman heard the sound, he was a little strange, walked over, poked his head out, and looked down. Because of the thick fog, it was very blurry below, but a huge blurred black shadow could be seen below, gently hitting the wall of the ship with his forehead. What's that? The sailor was curious, and stuck his head out to see the dark shadow. Then the shadow suddenly raised its head, as if smiling at the sailor, and it opened its fangs, leapt upwards and devoured it. The dark shadow became clearer and clearer, and the sailor was suddenly startled and retracted his head sharply, but it was too late. Ah, a miserable scream, a headless corpse, blood gushing, like a fountain, whoosh, extremely bloody and terrifying. What's wrong? It's not good, a soldier died, he was killed by the sea king, come on. Quote. The sailor's mouth was wide open, his eyes wide open as he looked at the headless corpse that was spurting blood, and suddenly the shouts resounded throughout the warship. How could the Sea Kings take the initiative to attack? It's not the same as it used to be. A large number of soldiers with guns hurried to the road, and sure enough, they saw a headless corpse, and a large amount of blood stained the deck, and everyone looked very nervous. And Fan and Major General Geyer also arrived, their faces very ugly. The Neptune beast actually took the initiative to attack, is that machine ineffective? Major General Gear frowned. One of the sailors suddenly sat on the ground, looked at him in horror, and pointed behind several soldiers with his mouth wide open. What's wrong? The soldiers clenched their weapons tightly in front of the Shang, and looked at the sailor with some bewilderment. Suddenly, a thick fishy smell came, and then it was dark in front of their eyes, and they didn't know anything. The entire warship was crumbling by the Sea Kings. Brute, quote, and Fan was instantly enraged, and dared to eat people in front of him and provoke, he was really looking for death. The second generation ghost drew his sword out, and a little under his feet, he disappeared in place in an instant, and the whole person appeared in the air. 
Chop, quote, from high in the sky, and Fan directly locked onto the Sea King who had provoked him just now, and was just about to slash with anger. Suddenly, at this moment, a Sea King suddenly jumped up from the sea behind and Fan, opened his bloody mouth, and devoured it. And Fan's pupils shrank, and he immediately ran upwards in a row for a month, avoiding this bloody mouth. The Sea Kings plunged headlong into the sea, disappeared in a few seconds, and nothing was seen, and the sea was calm again, and the sea was filled with a white impenetrable mist. Quote exclamation mark exclamation mark exclamation mark quote. And Fan's eyes flashed red, and he was very angry. On the other side of the warship, Rear Admiral Gear inspected the machine and was instantly shocked. What's wrong? And Fan landed beside Major General Jair, and when he saw his face change suddenly, he couldn't help but ask a little strangely, and he had a bad premonition in his heart. This thing is not Halu Stone. Major General Jair's face changed wildly and said, Begabank was transformed according to the characteristics of the Halu Stone, so as to deter the Sea Kings, but now it is. Major General Gear didn't say any more, he said hatefully, what the hell is going on, why was the Halu Stone replaced with something else? And Fan next to him listened to the words of Major General Jeer, and his face was very gloomy. Almost a second, it occurred to him that this might be a conspiracy, a conspiracy against him. The fifth old star said that he would let him go to the city in half a month, but suddenly changed it for three days, he even believed it, and got on the boat stupidly, what a foolishness. And Fan's face was cloudy, and the more he thought about it, the more he thought about it. In an instant, and Fan looked at Major General Geyer and changed. Major General Geyer looked at Anfin's extremely cold eyes, and now as long as he is not a fool, he knows that there is something wrong with it. Without Halu Stone, we could be attacked by the Sea Kings at any time. And Fan asked coldly. Ha, huh, and Fan's eyes froze suddenly. Shaving, quote. And Fan's figure appeared in the sky, his eyes were cold and looked at the Sea Kings who were about to devour again, and sneered, you want to eat people again, are you too greedy? What do you think of me? As soon as he finished speaking, a supreme slash slashed this sea king in half. A fiery red blood flower suddenly scattered all over the sky. Listening to the sound of rolling waves behind them, several soldiers quickly turned around and looked at the sea kings who had become two halves in the sky. Feeling the blood dripping down their faces, they sat on the ground in fright, almost peeing their pants. These seamen were very frightened, if it weren't for an fan, they would probably be entering the Sea King's stuffed meal. Be alert to me, some Sea Kings are more cunning than us humans. Major General Gear turned around, looked at several soldiers who could no longer stand up, and said loudly. With Lord Anfin here, all the Sea Kings have been beheaded by him. Don't be afraid, quote. Major General Jair directly brought a high hat to an fan, but it was one thing for an fan to accept it or not. Yes, thinking that this sea king was cut in half by Lord and Fan's knife, several soldiers forced themselves to calm down, stood up from the deck, and stood up with their bodies straight. The thick smell of blood in the air was emitted, and an Fan frowned, because the creatures under the sea, as long as they were carnivores, were absolutely hypersensitive to the smell of blood. That is to say, there may be a large wave of sea kings who will attack later, and the more I think about it, the tighter and Fan's brows become, these sea kings have the same intelligence as humans, and they are huge and numerous, and they will come one after another when the time comes, but it is very tricky. Without the power of mass destruction, he can't hold it at all, maybe he may be in trouble, you must know that he is a devil fruit ability, and he can't get wet. And Fan suddenly had an idea in his heart, it is better to sacrifice himself for others than to sacrifice himself for me. Let me ask you, how far is the advanced city from us? Anfin asked Major General Jair. Lord Anfin, about ten minutes. Quote, ten minutes, I see. And Fan nodded indifferently, holding the advanced city finger in his hand, and his right hand suddenly made a pistol posture, aiming at Major General Jair's temple. You can die. Quote, Anne, mortal, you, what do you mean? Rear Admiral Gear broke out in a cold sweat. I suspect you might be trying to harm me. And Fan said indifferently. What? Impossible. How could I have harmed Lord Anfin, I don't have the ability to do this. I am also a victim now. Just like you, Major General Gear said with tears on his face. I know, and Fan said lightly. Ha, huh. Major General Gel was confused, and even knew why he wanted to kill him. I'm a very suspicious person, 
and all suspects must die, and I'd rather kill 3,000 by mistake than let go of 800. Quote. What's more, as a rear admiral, you died suddenly, so someone will take the initiative to help me investigate the people who want to yin me, and when the time comes, I will touch the melons in Shunton. I'll help you get revenge when the time comes. And Fan said lightly, in addition, don't be a navy in the next life, I hate the navy. Quote. Refers to grabbing bullying. Quote. Bang. Major General Geyer's eyes widened, he couldn't believe that he was blocked in a pool of blood, he didn't understand how Enfan killed him like garbage casually, he was also a major general. Enfan swept the naval soldiers below and smiled coldly, one rear admiral is not enough, all the soldiers on the entire warship must die, only in this way can the naval headquarters be alarmed. HMPH, dare to yin me, I want to use the Sea King to borrow a knife to kill people. Thousands of calculations, I don't know if I have telekinesis. And Fan used telekinesis to levitate in the air, looking at the warship, holding the second generation ghost Che with both hands, and said coldly in his heart. Whoever it is, I'm going to make you pay. And Fan's blood red eyes and said coldly. After speaking, a red light slashed out. Looking at the steel cast below, the guards were deep and strict, and there were ten huge naval warships guarding the advanced city submarine prison, and Fan's eyes narrowed slightly. No wonder since its establishment, only the Golden Lion has successfully escaped from prison, but the courage of the Golden Lion to dare to cut off his legs is really praised. Quote. And Fan slowly descended from the sky and landed at the gate of the advanced city prison. Who, looking at and Fan who suddenly appeared, all the soldiers were startled and raised their weapons one after another. Don't be nervous, everyone, I'm an fan, a caretaker sent by the world government. And fan ignored so many guns and said indifferently. With such a backward firearm, it can't hurt him, and when will it be found out that Barrett is saying that he can threaten him? You are the chief of the guards sent by the world government, isn't it half a month later, why is it so fast? A prison officer said with some suspicions, they did receive a person named and fan to advance the city as the chief guard, but it was only half a month later, and I heard that it was a very powerful person to be the guard. But seeing that an fan is only 1.6 meters tall, and he is obviously a boy's face, how can he not be very strong? Are you suspicious of me? And fan's pupils instantly contracted, and he looked at the prison officer hideously. Don't dare, quote, the prison officer's hair exploded, and he immediately bowed his head and said, I'm sorry, let me contact the prison director. Quote, Go, quote, yes, a short time later, a man wearing demon wings and two horns on his head walked out. And Fan recognized it at a glance, isn't this the famous Magellan in one piece who holds the poisonous fruit? Your Anfin, Magellan took a step forward, looked at Anfin, who was less than one meter six, and asked. Is this clearly just a child? We have asked the world government for people many times, but we didn't expect to shoot a child over, isn't this too contemptuous of the city's big prison? It's too child's play. Magellan was a little unhappy, his face was full of contempt, and he didn't take an fan in his eyes. Maybe because he is a poison, he has diarrhea for nearly 10 hours, he only works 4 hours a day, and he sleeps 8 hours a day, if he often likes to know the facts of the outside world, he will not be so contemptuous. I am Anfin, and Fan looked up at Magellan's face and said calmly. Are you coming alone? asked Magellan, who suddenly realized that there were no other ships except for the ten warships. No, there was a rear admiral and a hundred soldiers who followed me, but when I entered the windless zone, I found that the halo stone that shocked the sea kings was actually transferred and was besieged by a large group of sea kings. And Fan said with a look of pity. What? Magellan suddenly became serious. Wait a minute, I want to contact the world government headquarters. Quote. After saying that, Magellan walked away, took out a snail, and said something on the side after connecting it. Moments later, Magellan handed the snail to Anfin. The five elder star elders want to talk to you. Quote. And Fan suddenly became serious, five old star elders. What's going on? Why did you go to the city in three days? And you're healed, asked the five elder stars. This question, and Fan sighed in his heart, it seemed that the guess was true, someone pretended to pass on the order of the five old stars, dismantled the sea tower stone that escorted his warship, and then killed himself with the knife of the sea king, what a good calculation. And Fan sneered in his heart, he told the five old stars all the things, of course, he
he killed Rear Admiral Geyer and destroyed the warship and caused the death of a hundred naval soldiers, but only told the five old stars as Magellan said just now. However, for some questions about the five old stars, such as how he could escape safely and come to advanced city, and the reason why the injury healed so quickly, and fans' direct and indifferent words instantly exploded into huge waves. What did you say? Did you eat the replica fruit? At the world government headquarters, the five old stars were all shocked. Copy fruit, which has the ability to copy any ability, belongs to the fruit of the heavens, and is nothing more than the legendary infinite fruit. The infinite fruit was too ethereal, making the five elders suspect that this fruit actually didn't exist at all, and it was impure. Yes, elder five elder stars, I ate the replication fruit, and I copied the abilities of the two people in the original Holy Land Noble Region competition, the telekinesis ability and the recovery ability. And Fan said again, he said about the characteristics of the ability to copy, except for the difference between the copy object on the illustrated book, the copy ability will automatically disappear, everything else is correct. And Fan, do you want to go back to the world government headquarters and become the head of the World Intelligence Agency? At this moment, the five old stars valued and Fan by a higher degree, if they paid more attention to it before, then they attach great importance to it now. Even the five old stars are very blushing. Listening to the words of the five old stars, and Fan suddenly smiled slightly, his goal was achieved, from now on his position in the hearts of the five old stars is irreplaceable, even the current red Inu Qingzi Yellow Ape plus the Warring States General and the Z General are not enough for him alone. And importantly, some of the abilities of the infinite fruit can be masked by the ability to copy the fruit, which is actually Anfin's main idea. He doesn't want to use any ability to sneak around, of course, he has to keep it secret now, except for the five old stars, it is better for others not to know for the time being. It's already a wood show in the forest, and it's not good to cause a tornado. So just now, Anfan used his telekinesis to cut off the air, so that what Anfan said could not be heard by the people around him at all. Elder 5, I think I'd better stay in Advance City for the time being. And Fan said. The five old stars thought for a moment, and then said, that's good. In this case, you can stay in Advance City, but in half a year, you will go directly to Justice Island to serve as the head of the intelligence agency. Quote. Yes. Quote. The fifth old star thought for a while, and then said, here in Advance City, I grant you absolute supreme power, and I have the power to execute any prisoner in Advance City at will, and the prison director obeys you. If necessary, you can remove him from his position. Quote. And Fan didn't isolate this passage with his mental power, and everyone around him heard it. Magellan, did you hear that, from now on obey Anfin's orders? The five old stars shouted at this time. Magellan stood still, shocked and speechless, and looked at Anfan in disbelief. Your Excellency, I don't know if you heard the words of the five elder star elders. And Fan looked at Magellan with a nonchalant smile. I hear you, and I'm at your disposal. Quote. Magellan looked at Anfin with a calm expression. Good. And Fan smiled at the corner of his mouth and said, In this case, how many prisoners are there in the city now? Listening to Anfan's cold question, Magellan was stunned for a moment, didn't care, and frowned slightly. The prisoners who are now being held in the city are rare in the entire history, a total of more than 300,000 prisoners. So many. And Fan was a little surprised. How could this place accommodate so many people in this advancing city? Yes, a lot. However, the Red Lotus Hell on the first and second floors of the Advancement City, and the Demon Beast Hell Hell account for the vast majority, and they are all small characters. Magellan said lightly. Then how many soldiers are there in our city prison now? And Fan said again. There are one, 36,105 of the prison officers of the Advanced City, including me, and there are more than 100 of the Jailer Beasts. Quote. That's a lot of people. Quote. Magellan instantly became proud. This is natural, the City U prison is the largest prison in the world, directly under the world government, and it is known as an impregnable wall. Quote. Looking at Magellan's pride and listening to his words, and Fan couldn't help but think of the Golden Lion, and the corners of his mouth suddenly hooked. If you want to enter our advanced city, you must have a full body check, Magellan led the way in front of him and walked towards the front of the advanced city, saying as he spoke. Because you are the highest authority in the advancement city currently appointed by the five old stars, you don't need to check your whole body. 
After walking for a distance, Magellan turned around and glanced at Enfan's black suit and the second-generation ghost Che hanging from his waist. Hum, Enfan nodded calmly, not being provoked by Magellan's agitation method. Magellan's careful thoughts, he didn't know yet, he was going to play privileges, how bad. Following Magellan to the huge gate, Magellan waved to the prison guards standing in a row on both sides, indicating that the gate could be opened. Pass. The jailer stood at the front, shouting into the floodgates. As soon as the jailer's words fell, the floodgates began to rise slowly. I hope that your excellency Anfin will abide by the rules of our advanced city. Magellan said suddenly, with a hint of threat in his tone. Hearing this, Anfan glanced at Magellan deeply and did not speak. Looking at the gradually rising iron gate, Magellan's face was expressionless, and it was very dangerous to advance into the city, and almost every few days there were prisoners rioting. A prison officer who is not strong will definitely not see the sun tomorrow. If this little imp is willing to abide by the rules, then he will ensure that he spends the half year safely and safely, and he can play as much as he wants. Otherwise, Magellan had actually positioned and fan in his heart as the son of a world noble, who came here to guild, and Fan's strength was not amplified by him, but was reduced countless times, he really couldn't imagine that the ten-year-old and Fan had stronger strength than him. Even if he thought about it, it was probably him who had a nightmare. So Magellan said a word, and didn't say so much. If and Fan knew what Magellan was thinking, he was a child of the world's nobles who came here to guild and have fun, it is estimated that he would be very speechless. Have you ever seen a world aristocrat who can drive the five old stars? Sure enough, there are a lot of people in one piece who have a tendon in their heads, and they are all gone. Streamer really thinks that there are a lot of people with low IQ in one piece. Closing parenthesis. Because the advanced city is built in the center of the windless zone, no matter how evil the advanced city is, it is an extremely powerful prisoner. If you want to escape from here, it is simply impossible, plus the advanced city, there is only one exit from the main gate, and there is an invincible strong person to suppress it inside, and if there is a riot, it is still a question whether you can see the sun outside. Therefore, to advance the defense outside the city, it is also very simple, there are only two gates as a line of defense, the first is this iron gate, and the second is simpler, which is two tall wooden gates. Anfin followed Magellan through the first line of defense and walked to the two tall wooden doors, where Magellan stretched out his big hand and pushed the doors open with a gentle force. As soon as he stepped in, and Fan felt a cold aura coming, accompanied by bursts of screams, crying for help, resentment, and shock. The stench of rotting corpses, the smell of blood and stench on the prisoners, the smell of corrosion and mustiness between the walls, and the smell of all kinds of powerful beasts surging into the depths of the city. It's better to push into the interior of the city. Quote, feeling the extremely familiar smell of the advancing city, listening to the desperate screams of the prisoners, Magellan had a comfortable expression, as if he was enjoying it very much, and a grim smile was revealed, and his eyes were slightly aimed at Enfan. At this time, Enfan was also staring at him, his eyes were extremely sarcastic and disdainful. This prison is your home, your home, said Anfin, as if he had heard a big joke. What? Is there a problem? Magellan frowned and looked at Anfin. This place is disgusting. And Fan said coldly, I hope everyone will support it and subscribe more.